Hello, good morning. Good afternoon. Hope everyone's doing well today. Today, we are doing the monthly art stream. Yes, I'm wearing the same shirt from last night. I just don't want to wash more laundry. <laughs> so first, we're going to start off with our calligraphy journal. So if anybody's new to the channel, anybody who follows gets their name written on the first of every month. So you can look through the pages from last month's. So these are primarily all the followers from the month of August. So today we're going to do all the followers from September. It says I gained 30 followers, but then I also lost 10. So we only got 20 names to write, so we're going to be speed running. And then after, we're going to do our portrait cards for the month of September. So anybody who gifted a total of 5 subs by the end of the month gets a portrait card. So these are two examples. These are two from August. This was Cokes and then Emmy Beef. And today... We had a lot of we had a, we got a we had a lot of fucking subs during September. Shout out to Kobobo, top gifter of the month. But I have one, two, three, four. Titans wanted two cards because they didn't get last month. Five, six. Set. I have a fuck ton of cards to do today. So. I think stream is probably going to go for probably four or five hours, so feel free, hang and chill out today. Um, I'm going to be focusing on like actually doing the art, but you know. Here, let's get like... There we go. <laughs> well, look, we'll get close to these later so we actually start coloring these in, because I did the pencils today. I did these all in like an hour, that's why stream is like ten minutes late, because like I had to make breakfast and then lunch for my sister. So it's not going to be live for long today, because we had... We had a lot of people be eligible for the sketch cards this month, so I want to make sure they're good. The reason why I don't do the special pencil sketches on stream is because it takes too fucking long. Also, the camera doesn't pick up the pencil at all, so. My hair looks so fucked. Okay. Let's go ahead and get started. So, how today's gonna go is I'm gonna write names, and then chat can ask me questions, chat amongst yourselves, all that type of cool jazz. But before we get started, let's go ahead and get a sub goal up for today. Oh, there it is. Our new monthly leaderboard is now cleared. If you want to get on the board today, all you got to do is gift or cheer. <laughs> Next portrait card confirmed. Yep. Let's see, we're at 109, so let's put our goal at 110. If I can get one sub today, I'll be happy. Okay. Goal up for today is 110. We did hit 110 last night, which is crazy. Y'all went insane for the sub goals last month, so we have a lot of bonus streams lined up for this upcoming month. If you want to see the updated Twitch schedule, I'm going to go ahead and link it in chat. Okay. Now this is all set up. I have to, like, move my camera a little bit. That way, I kind of want you guys to actually see me working. I just have to remember to move it back when I'm done. Hi, Kobobo. Welcome in. Hope we're doing well today, hon. Okay, let's go ahead and get started. You have to make sure everything's in frame. Let me move my other pens. What was that accent? I don't know. I'm British. I'm actually born in the UK. <laughs> okay, I need to... I, I am so... <laughs> I was so unprepared for today because I woke up a little bit late. I woke up at 9 and I was like, fuck. Or like right before 9, but like I wasn't like up and running until 9. <clears throat> so like I my daily schedule was like shifted by an hour this morning. Well, you know I'm here. Okay, let's go ahead and get started with names. Oh, 
Oh, you know what I didn't do? I didn't draw the guidelines. Fuck. Hopefully I'll have enough made. Doesn't this kind of sound like Undertale? It's Pokemon, but it sounds like Undertale. Okay, we had hibiscus tea. First name of the day. I didn't draw the guidelines. Oh no. Sag. It's the one from the top. And I, I don't draw lines across the whole page. I usually just do dots in the margin. Then three in between. One space. The guidelines are done. I might have to get a different red pen because this one's already busted. I remember last month this one was already on its last leg. I just forgot to switch them out. Because you can kind of see how it's feathering already. I'm gonna switch out this red pen. Copy pens are like eight dollars, so maybe don't get those. Yeah, that's why. Like this is like the cheapy set I can find on Amazon. If you wanna know what pens I'm using, can I go ahead and link them in the chat? I'm gonna switch out this red for another one. one. Okay, we got serotonin vibes. Dude, I love the short usernames. We got Elith. <laughs> 20 for 3? That's crazy. That's like 7 bucks a pop. No, that's way out of my budget. Like, you know when you go to the art store and they let you try the pens? I don't usually try them because I know once I try it, I'm going to want to buy it. Oh, do you guys want to do a Gamba? To see if I messed up any names? Let's do a quick Gamba. I mean, I'm only writing 20, so hopefully I shouldn't mess up any. Gamba, yeah, chatters. Go Gamba. Do you think I will mess up and screw up any names? Go Gamba. There's been two months in a row. 
that I haven't messed up any names, so I've been on a pretty good run. Okay, I have a tripod right here. You can't see it. This right out of frame. I have to move it. It was my old camera tripod, but this one kept on shifting. 1.3 can believe. Holy shit. You crazy. Any doubters? Dude, imagine I mess up on the last name again. That'd make me very sad. What if I mess up right now? <laughs> Believers losing their mind. We got inside Claudius' mind. Speaking of art supplies being expensive, Meg Art Channel, you're right. We can go ahead and shout out the art channel real quick. If you enjoy more chill content, or if you like art content in general, you can go ahead and check out my second channel. It is peace and underscore art. If you're watching on desktop, you can click the little follow button at the top of your chat box, or if you are on mobile, you can go ahead and click the link I just sent in chat and go follow that art channel. Streams will be starting next week, probably on Monday. My goal is to do a fully fleshed painting every week, so go follow. I'd appreciate if everybody watching right now followed. It is free. I think we gained three followers yesterday, so that was great. Thank you, chatters. Here we got Webb's Fire. Okay, we got Rockhead619. These calligraphy streams are always very relaxing. Thank you. That's what I like about the art streams is that, like, I get to zone out and focus. And then, you know, chat gets to vibe. <clears throat> Any doubters on that prediction? Anybody think I'm going to throw? Somebody just put 10 points in doubt. What's the worst that could happen? You lose 10 points, and if you win, you get 1k. Insane. me with that Nick doubter arc. I feel like everybody starts off as a believer and then they turn into a doubter over time. Especially when I'm gaming. But you know what, I don't mind. 
if more people doubt, then that just makes the win so much better. Here we go. I'm that boy. Twelve. <laughs> well, we get to try out this new red pen now. Oh my god, look at this. Ooh, look at how nice that new pen is. We got Angel Bear 4. Can pins just stay this new all the time? That'd be great. Here we got Felix Best Grill. There's intentionally no I, so I didn't mess up right there. No, no. <laughs> I mean, it took me a long time to, like, learn how to use a Sharpie properly. Like, you know, like the regular fine tip. You're supposed to use the side of the pen, not the tip. I feel like my mom engraved that into me when I was younger, though. Because she was very strict with her art supplies. But then, because of that, she never used them herself, so they've just been sitting on a shelf in our hallway for, like, 20-plus years. Unused. <laughs> that kind of makes sense. <laughs> Has nobody, like, ever properly, like, taught you how to use supplies? Because the issue I have with all those, like, short-form art videos is that they don't actually teach you how to use the supplies. Like, a lot of, like, how much you hold your pen, how you, like, how much pressure you apply dictates how your actual strokes and lines will look. And they don't explain that in those type of tutorial videos. They just show you what's happening. That's another reason why I don't like digital art as much, is because you kind of lose that... Uh, controversial. But I think digital art takes a lot less craftsmanship than traditional. I understand that when you do digital art, you have to like learn how to use the digital tools, but to me... It takes a lot more time and effort to learn how to use traditional mediums than digital. Like, I still appreciate digital art. I still think it's art. But I definitely will gravitate more towards traditional. <laughs> if you use too much pressure when you're using, like, graphite or pencil lead, use a softer lead type. I, would, I personally use 5B. And I don't, I'll do it on the back of this card, but it's a softer lead and it's also like thicker width too. So you don't necessarily have to put a lot of pressure down to get a decent gray on your paper. We got Hickson cookies. <laughs> Sorry, the next name is funny. I don't know if it'll fit though.
So you guys can probably read the name. <laughs> See, like, I don't mind troll names like this. It's just if they're, like, obviously inappropriate, I'm not gonna write it. Like, I think somebody had Lightning McQueer, but I changed it to McQueen in the book. Okay, we got Shampoo Poopy Pee. <laughs> Hi, Pride. Hi, Emmy. Welcome in, guys. Hope you're doing well today. I'm doing okay. I'm tired. I woke up late at 9, so I had to scramble to get ready for stream today. But, you know, I'm here. Oh, Emmy, I have your car done. I gotta color it later. So this will be done probably in, like... I can do yours first if you're gonna be in chat for, like, the next hour. Because I always try and do, like, the Chatter's portrait cards when they're actually in stream... That way they can actually see it be done. And I also have Nyx's and Cole Bobo's sketches done too. Oh my god, I almost spelled orange wrong. That could have been really bad. I need to go back to first grade. Okay, we got vocal orange. Here for the other two hours. Ayo. Yeah, so I'll probably do Emmy's, Nyx's, and then Kobobo's cards in that order. <laughs> Believer lost. No, not yet, not yet. I didn't screw it up. I know how to spell orangey. Oh, I have my iPad on a stand on the edge of the table because I don't have a lot of room on my desk. So, like, every time I scroll on it, it's, like, teetering off the edge of the table. Oopsie. I almost couldn't find my iPad this morning because I usually put it, like, under my pillow because I don't have, like, any desk tape, desk space to put it down anywhere. But it, it fell behind my bed. <laughs> I was losing my mind. I couldn't find it. Because I have my bed frame pushed up right against the wall. But there's still like a small enough crack to where my iPad can fit through it. And then it falls on the floor. Because like some nights, I either like fall asleep watching videos or streams. Or like reading manga or something. That's why I keep it on my bed. I also need to catch up on my webtoon comics. I haven't read them in like two months. Here we got Hello, Pum King. There's no P there. There's intentionally no P. <coughs> Peace in 17 needs another monitor. I do. But then it's like, I don't have enough space. If I'm able to move, then I might get, like, an, another monitor set up. Because I, I would love to have a monitor just for chat. Because, like, the chat box takes up, like, a quarter of my laptop screen right now. Oh, here's the new red. We love her. You think you need an actual desk first? That too. That too. <clears throat> but if I am able to move, the setup that I'm going to have is I'm going to have probably my TV on my dresser like it is now. And then have a desk for normal stream so it'll have my like mini art setup here for calligraphy, 
the regular smaller desk for my computer and then lights and then on the other half of the room I'll have my art stream set up so that way I could just leave everything there because until I'm able to move or if I don't move I'm gonna have to do art streams on this setup in the corner of the room so I'm gonna have to like move everything whenever I do the art stream which is fine because my desk is big enough to fit a canvas So I think the largest largest canvas I got was like a 16 by 24 or something like that. Okay, we got laughing mushroom. Ooh, those trumpets sounded weird. Here we got Kingling. Okay, I think we got like 10 more names left, so we're we're speed running right now. I've noticed whenever I get a lot of offline follows is whenever my TikTok does well. Like when the food drive video came out back in May, I gained like 30 offline follows in a day. It was crazy. Because that usually never happens. Because I usually get like one or two every day. Like I don't care too much about follower count because your follower count does not correlate with your viewer count. That's why if sponsorships look at your follower count, it doesn't really matter. Like, just because you have a million followers doesn't mean a million people are going to interact with your posts. Okay, we got Kaidenes Shijiro. Well, you followed in April, because the food drive clip was in May. Yeah, I agree. Following during live is cringe because I, I saw a clip talking about it this morning, but the the girl was saying how she doesn't thank followers during a live because if you get thanked during a stream, then it kind of pressures you indirectly to chat. That's why I don't say thank you for the follow so-and-so if I get a follow live. Also, I don't want to showcase that attention. Cause like I've expressed that, you know, if I get follow botted, or I don't want people to get used to me thanking followers. Cause then it's like, what happens if I get like 10 followers in 10 minutes? It'd be fucking annoying. That's why typically I only thank donations and subs and bits. Cause I don't like when like, an alert disrupts what you're saying. Like, if you think an alert mid-sentence, it annoys me and probably the viewers. Hi, Mac. You're at the store? Okay. Have fun at the store. We got Mr. Dream Come True. You didn't know you were clipping on accident? 
Huh? You can delete your clips, you know, if you make an accidental clip, you have Mr. Dream come true. All you have to do is go to... Oh, fuck. The non-affiliates have... Oh yeah, creator dashboard clips, clips you've created, and then you can delete it. <laughs> no, I can tell when y'all clip accidentally. Because usually if you don't title a clip, then that means it was an accident. Or you just don't want to spend the time to name a clip. Oh shit, sorry, I dropped my pencil. Because I still watch every single clip that you guys make. And I can delete whatever clips are on my channel, so if I don't like a clip, I can delete it. Because there was one clip where somebody clipped me, like, getting up from my chair. It was a non-follower, and I was like, that's kind of sus. Because obviously that means they're trying to get, like, an ass shot, right? So now only followers can clip the stream. That way I can monitor. Oh, I fucked up one of my lines. Oh, I screwed up the first one. You should delete, like, half of them. <laughs> nah, because, like, with clips, the more that are made are for the better. Because, like, the algorithm sees that. But then also, if you title a clip, people are more likely to watch it. Prime example, um, during Wednesday, or, yeah, Wednesday's Fall Guys stream, nobody clipped it, but then I made a clip Thursday morning. I titled it, THE CRAZIEST LUCK, in all caps, and it got 15 views by the end of the day. So, TLDR, if you're gonna clip a moment, just fucking name it something really clickbaity. Easy. Oh my god, I wonder who this is. Hmm. Peace I too. Hmm. Here we got peace in art. Hmm. Who is that? I wonder. Made your first title to one. Hey, yo. You also can title your clips after you make it. All you gotta do is go to create a dashboard, video producer clips, and then you can change the title. Because sometimes what I do, if I make a clip on mobile, and then I publish it, when I get it, when I have access to my laptop, I'll go back and retitle it. Because clipping on mobile is dog shit. Like, it lags and it crashes half the time. But then there's obviously going to be moments when you're not watching on desktop. You got Mega Evolutions. You missed the Kirby cupcakes? No, they were so bad. They were so bad. Did you watch the VOD? Cringe. <laughs> I was gonna repost them to like IG, but they looked horrible, so I wasn't gonna repost them. <laughs> They're so bad. Guys, should I become a baker? We got Omnom115. 
They were so good. <laughs> sure. Hi, Titans. Welcome in. Hope we're doing well today, hun. Yeah, it's been, what, 12 hours? Oh, I, I'm doing two cards for you, Titans. We're doing the two meme ones you sent me, so. Look forward to that, man. I'm a piece I do ship. <laughs> I mean, if I do move, we're for sure gonna do an occasional cooking stream. Because I think a fun series would either be doing cooking mama recipes or family recipes. I think that'd be fun. But if I do move, I'd have to get all new kitchen supplies because... The place we're looking at, if it does go through, like, they have an air fryer and then a mini oven. But that's all they have. So we'd have to either buy used or buy new cooking utensils. They got mapleism. I desire to be made of, made fun of here. That sounds very masochistic. Anyway. <laughs> if they were ugly, I would have said nothing. Because my mother said... If I have nothing good to say, don't say it. Exactly. <laughs> Your mom raised you right. Okay, I think we're in... We're in, like, the final eight. Get ready to spam. I was here, guys. Here we got It's Jax, bro. <laughs> My number one gifter badge flushed. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, y'all got it all month, so don't worry about it. I'm sad that September is over, though. I missed the discount. I gifted so many subs yesterday to people. I think I gifted a total of like five to different channels. Did your resub go through? Um. Usually, if it re- Because. I think you resub not on the first Kobobo. If you look at your- Go to settings, my subscriptions, it should tell you when it does process for a resub. But in order to get a notification pop-up on screen, if you when you log into a live, it'll have like a little pop-up at the bottom of the chat box. Be like, hey, do you want to share your blank resub message? <laughs> BRB taking out a small loan. <laughs> no, don't do that. Don't spend your savings, please. No, student debt is already a lot. I know I can't afford to donate to any channels this month. Like, I literally need to save any money I can get. I asked my sister last night, I was like, hey. I was like, can we go out and get dessert? And she was like, no. You told me that we need to save our money. Because remember like a week ago, she texted me. She was like, hey, can we get McDonald's? And then I said, no, we need to save our money. So she basically just did an Uno reverse on me last night. Because there's this, like, bubble tea slash shave ice place that opened up near me. And it looks so good. But it's a bit expensive. So when I move, I can try it, I guess. We got Joby Retrograde. Hi, Kingly. Welcome in. Oh, I just wrote your name. Let me go back to it. We got Kingly. There you are, because you followed in September. I'm a titch, titch. I'm a Twitch Pro 101. I think I'm pretty uh, savvy concerning Twitch. Yeah, I know you're new to the channel, Kingly, but on the first of every month, I write all of my followers' names from the previous month. So today we're writing all the followers from September. And then we also are doing the sketch card portrait cards for anybody who gifts five subs. 
And we had, I think, seven people eligible for sketch cards for September. So we're going to be doing those after the calligraphy is done. Wowie. I'll pay for your carpool tunnel treatment. Nah, I think I should be fine. <laughs> Gotta go stream? Um, self promo. Cringe. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> Bye, Titans. We'll see you later. Have fun with your stream, man. <laughs> I'm not gonna clap people for that, but. <laughs> I would actually never do that, but you literally did! <laughs> I'm kidding. Just don't do that shit again. I know other people will fucking clap you. That was not my intent, I know. I'm trolling. I'm trolling. I don't give a shit. Cause like in my head, self-promo literally does not work. Hi, Aslan. I'm just here to say cope. Thank you. <laughs> Peace I do self-report. No. Never. Hi, Aslan. Hope doing well. Three nights going well, man. Oh, we had Belgi set. I think the only time the calligraphy, like, legitimately, like, hurt my fingers was when we did our first ever calligraphy stream. Oh, we're in the final three names, guys. Final three. Okay, why isn't... Oh, what was I gonna say? Oh, yeah, for the April Fool stream. At that point, I had like 300 followers. And I literally wrote all 300 names. It took like six, seven fucking hours. It was horrible. Like, my hands were like literally blistered and bruised after that stream. But it was a funny gag. So then I decided to do calligraphy every month instead. Because I initially was just going to do the calligraphy like, oh my god, writing on my followers' names as a one-off stream. But then people really liked it. And then it was very eye-opening in the sense of behind every name there's a number. Or behind every number there's a person. So, that's why we do it every month. Did imagine if I get to a point where I get like thousands of followers every month, I'd cry. I'd cry. Then I have to ring Kingly up be like, Hey, are you gonna pay for my carpal tunnel like you said in chat months ago? Is that a good callback? <clears throat> 3.5 mil? Sheesh! If I unfollow and refollow, will you write my name again? No. And also, if you unfollow, you won't be able to chat for 10 minutes, you dummy! Haha, <laughs> <laughs> cause we're on 10 minute follow mode. Wait, what if I changed it to 24 hour or yeah, 24 hour follow mode and then Aslane just gets fucked? Haha. <laughs> troll the troll. Okay, we got Trev L. Steinberg. <laughs> Yoinked for real. Oh my god, oh my god. <laughs> Guess another page done, guys. We only got two names left. We are speedrunning. But I appreciate everybody who's watching right now. I really do. Thank you for hanging out. I would do art more often on this channel, but I feel like art content isn't nearly as engaging as the normal streams. That's why it's a separate channel. Okay, I need to refresh this. Yeah, final two.
Thoughts on get- wait. Thoughts on Chatters getting your art tatted? Uh... Why would they do that? <laughs> and like, what piece would they choose to get tatted? Hmm. I think it'd be kind of weird if it was done without permission. I think if someone were to get a tattoo of my work, I think it would be adequate if it got, like, commissioned. Hey, yo! Thank you for the 100 bits, go Bobo. I appreciate that. Thank you! Hey, yo! First cheer of the month, guys! Did I do that right? Yeah. You should have gotten bonus channel points as well, because you get a bonus 100 or something? Oh, fuck. If you cheer... Um, first time of the month. I can top that. Wait, Titans came back. <laughs> hey, yo! 400 bits. Thank you, Titans. <gasps> Thank you. Oh my god, now Titans is number two. How do I cheer more than 100? Um, you can type cheer and then whatever number. Type a million, see what happens. <laughs> I'm kidding. <laughs> I'm kidding. Hype train? Yeah, chatters. We are... Very close to a hype train. If we have one more person besides Cole Bobo or Titans cheer or subscribe, then we'll get a hype train going. Mod check any Oilers? <laughs> Fake as fuck because it would decline average chiller. <laughs> um, if I did have robot of uh, comms, I would definitely. I think tattoo designs are interesting because there's typically like black and white and I feel like that's type, my type of style. I follow this one artist on IG. I think it's called... What's ugh, what's their user? But I found them during a Twitch stream because they were doing illustrations on Twitch and then I followed their IG. They don't stream anymore, but... Hey, yo! Thank you for 200 more bits, Kobobo. I appreciate that. Thank you. Oh, their user is upcoming artist on IG. They're a tattooer in the UK, I think. But thank you. <gasps> no fucking shot. Slade. No way. Huh? Five gets it from Kingly. First time gifting in the chat. Thank you. Oh, Kingly. Uh, since you gifted five today, you are eligible for a sketch card for next month. So if you want that sketch card made, um, follow me on Twitter and then DM me a picture of yourself and then I'll draw a portrait card for you next month. But thank you, Kingly. I appreciate that. Let's see who got it. Um, <laughs> Jacob the Gamer and Pesachat. Oh my god, Claire got it. Claire's gonna love that. Downs, yo, and Cat. Dude, all regular chatters got subs. Thank you. <gasps> no way. No way. Okay, also. Yeah, wait. Can, can we get some W's in chat for... For Kingly? Wait, no, no, no. Wait, I gotta get my caps looking. Wingly! <laughs> but chatters, we got a hype train going in the chat room. If you want a chance to earn Twitch exclusive emotes, all you gotta do is subscribe or cheer in the chat room before the timer runs out. And you can get Twitch... Exclusive hype emotes. emotes. Wing we, uh. The new meta is anytime anybody gets a sub, we just add a W to their name. Like, mine is Wagon. Like, Reagan, but with a W. <laughs> no, I spelled it wrong. Fuck. Anyway, thank you guys for that hype train. Thank you. <laughs> Wagon. <laughs> okay, let's get the last name done. Let's speed run. I'm not gonna let chat distract me from this run. <laughs> Spelling her own name makes sense. Yeah, I just really suck at typing. I used to be proficient, but now I'm ass. And Kingly, you um, you have all months to send me a picture, so you don't gotta send it right now. Hey, yo! <clears throat> Thank you for that gifted sub, Kobobo. I appreciate that. Oh, went to Raven. They were they were literally just in chat. Yeah, yesterday. But thank you. Can we get some wool bobos in chat? Wool bobo. Thank you, Kobobo. 
Guys, we're on level three now. Hey, yo. Thank you. Oh, anybody who gifts or cheers will get their name written at the end of stream in the sub journal. So look forward to that, guys. <laughs> Whoa, Bobo. Oh, you don't post your face a lot? Oh, I see. Well, if you don't want to do a portrait, I for someone, let me try and find the card, actually. I think it was Crystal and Shop. They wanted me to do... Yeah. Let me go full fan. I can do some fan art. Because some, they wanted a Yoshi. So I did a Yoshi card instead. So if you want something else, I can work with you on that Kingling. Totally not a problem. Because five subs is a lot of money. Okay, like I said, stop distracting me. I'm trying to get this final name done, guys. This is just like those TikTok streams when they're like, Oh my god! Do not give me roses! You're gonna distract me! Like, it's literally just like that. I'll let you know when you brainstorm. Sounds good. You got all month, so no rush. As long as I get it by October 31st. Okay, we got Azure Eevee. Now, chatters, the run is done. I am done. We have written all the followers for the month of September. So, put your pencils down. Dude, we're literally at an hour uptime. There you go. Let's go ahead and finish the prediction. Did I mess up any names? No, I did not. Okay. So, let's go ahead and look at all the names that we did today. We're gonna do it slow for the VOD watcher. So if anybody wants to, anybody wants to screenshot their name if you see it. We had a total of 20 names today. We got Kingly who is here in chat. Hey, Wingly. <laughs> the W <be you> chat. <laughs> okay, there we go. All the followers from the month of September. Look at that. So I'll be posting pictures of these on Twitter later. So y'all can go follow my Twitter. That way you can check it out later. Um, but whoa, this Zoom is weird. Ah! Dude, another bit cheer, huh? Thank you for 500 more bits, Titans. I appreciate that. Thank you. Can we get some whitens in chat? <laughs> Wait, that sounds weird. Sounds kind of sus. <laughs> yeah, I'm not white. Yeah, I was like, you look fucking white as fuck, man. <laughs> it's like, you're like the whitest motherfucker out of everyone in chat, I think. <laughs> <laughs> I meant that in a nice way, of course. Twitch staff, if you're watching, I'm nice. But I'm Jewish, so... Oh. You get a pass. But thank you for those 500 bits. I appreciate that. <laughs> okay, anyway. We'll, we'll weed out the hype train before I run an ad. So, now is the perfect time to subscribe if you're not subscribed. Because if you subscribe now, you get to avoid the ad... And you can get some Twitch exclusive hype trend modes. So, <laughs> pass for being Jewish, you heard it here. Exactly. Um, and the ad is coming. You can avoid that ad by subscribing for $4.99, just $5. Skip your coffee and get ad reviewing all month long. Or you can link your Amazon Prime to your Twitch. You can hashtag sub for free with Prime every month. You can give it to your favorite streamer, which is me, obviously. Yeah, Cobobble's really wide as well. <laughs> Hey yo! Thank you for getting us to a level three hype train. Thank you, chat. We got level two completed. Thank you, guys. Thank you. Once again, to thank everybody who contributed. We had six subs. And, ooh, twelve hundred bits. Wowie. 
we had Titans, Kobobo, and Kingly. So thank you guys. Enjoy those emotes. Thank you. <clears throat> you have them both now? Oh my god, that's so cute. Hey, yo, uh, I have all the hype emotes because I donate all the time. Um, anyway, the ad is coming. So subscribe if you don't want to see that ad. After the ad, we're going to get started on our portrait sketch cards. So if you want more art and chill vibes, stick around. Dude, I'm talking so goddamn loud. I need to calm down. Oh, we also need a new sub goal. Sheesh. Dude, we're at 114 again? Fuck. <laughs> Scream right now. My sister would literally get so mad. Hi, Lemon! People, hey, welcome in. <laughs> okay, so let's go ahead and get a new sub goal up for today. We're at 114. Let's put it at 115 because chat was very generous. Shout out to Kingly and Kobobo for gifting today. Hello, peace. I too guess. <laughs> Y'all crazy. <clears throat> okay. Let's go back to sketch cards now. Um, so if you're new to stream, what we're going to do now, we got our calligraphy done for today. Only 20 names. Which is still a lot, mind you. But right now we're doing portrait cards. So anybody who gifted five or more subs during September gets a card drawn on stream. People pog. Wow. So I'm going to go ahead and get my pens, my pencils out. So. Politely home. Each card takes about 30-40 minutes, so we'll see how long stream goes. You only got one. I have all the hype train emotes. I got scammed. You only got one emote per hype train, that's the problem. So let's see. Let's get close-ups of the cards that we're doing today. So we have Emmy Beef. Nyx. Titan's first card. His second. We got Cox. Dude, Cox's hair is so cool. Uh, Kobobo. And then the Mac. I want to do like a more stylized one for Mac again, because. Okay, Mac has gotten like three cards already and they sent me the same goddamn picture. Like, it's a different pose but it's it's basically the same picture they sent me. So I'm doing a more stylized one. So if Mac gets mad, Mac can talk to my manager. Yeah, there's the hype train emotes like they rotate. So they change like every few months, I think. Like, I know if I'm ever in a stream, I always contribute to a hype stream, like, 100 bits just so I can get an emote. You should say something about it on Twitter for drama. No, I don't want to farm drama on Twitter because Twitter is so aggro. I feel like everybody on Twitter just hates the world. And then they just spread that hatred to everybody else in the world. Yeah, Max Portrait is definitely slightly more stylized this month. Hopefully they like it. What do you mean a more nice stylized picture? Mac is style. Wowee.
<laughs> Twitter is pain. Sounds about right. I'm gonna change my title. Let, let's let's bait a little bit. Let's see. <laughs> Love Mal. <clears throat> okay, title has changed. What do you guys think? Is the title good? <laughs> Hi, Mac. People, hey. Okay, I gotta find my pen. What are you saying about me? That you're very cool and funny. And last night, since you weren't in stream, we were talking mad shit. Okay, who should I do first? Emmy hasn't chatted in a while, so she might be lurking. But let's do people who are here. Let's do Nyx's first, because Nyx hasn't gotten any card. Yeah, Mac missed a hype train, Sag. But we can do hype trains every hour, Oilers. Wait, where's my hand? Peace I to Shake. Okay. Let's get to inking. Okay, Mac. You know, I hope you're able to get some rest last night, hun. I'm out of bagels. <laughs> How many do you usually have? Because I know at our shop, they usually sell bagels in like a 20 pack or like a six pack. But we can't even get through like a six pack. They usually get bad by the time. Okay, I actually need to look at the reference pictures. Because, like, even if you eat one bagel a day, sometimes they get bad by day five. Oops. Oh, I'm running over my Ethernet cable. That's not good. That's really bad. No, extra cream cheese is the way to go, my guy. Something's wrong with you if you don't like extra cream cheese. Okay, I'm looking at the... Oh, also, Nyx. Nyx sent me three pictures. I was gonna do your cosplay one. So maybe I can do that next time. Because <clears throat> that was honestly cute, but I wanted to do a card that, like, looks like you. Wait, don't eat the pumpkin? Oh, <laughs> what the fuck is... Lemon, lemon. You know when we raided out to Scootish and... <laughs> Like, Lemon was, like, one of the few chatters who was still active from my chat room after the raid and his chat. <laughs> saying, like, so much stupid shit. And, like, Scooters was responding to, like, everything you said. And it was the funniest thing to me. Because, like, it's obvious that you're goofing and gaffing, Lemon. It was funny that he was responding to it. <laughs> Lemon is funny. Like, Lemon will say, like... I feel like Lemon's chat style is they will say, like, random shit hoping that something sticks and will make the streamer laugh. I love attention. Yeah, I can tell. I'm gonna give you a hard photo this month. Oh, Mac, 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 Mac. You came in late. Scooty07. Enjoy that gifted sub I gave you, Kobo. But you better spam his emotes in his chat. Yours is more stylized this month. Cut. Mac, I shit on you earlier. Because I was like, Mac gives me a different picture every month. But it's literally the same goddamn pose. So. This is like total drama-esque style that we're doing today. For you. Because you send me basically the same goddamn picture every month. 
Give me a different pose or something. Like, put your hair up in a pony, maybe? I'm trying to make it easy on you by giving me the same picture, bruh. That's not how you help with creative, you know that. I like Nyx's eyes because they're kind of downturned. It's really pretty. In, in a non-weird way, I mean. It's very- it's a cool eye shape. Yeah, Scootish is a partnered streamer. That's why I don't... I get anxious whenever I do raid out to him because I feel like... There's been a few times where, like, I'll have four people watching and he's live and I don't want to raid because I feel like four people is negligible to somebody his size. I, like, I feel bad that I... We talked about it last night, but... I feel bad. Because, like... Nobody in his chat has ever been like, oh my god, a small raid. Like, nobody's ever said that, but I'm scared one day that's gonna happen. I've never been told that, and I'll always be self-conscious. Wait, about your downturn eyes? I think they're cute. Or about the raid shit. <laughs> oh, getting eye- No, your eyes are really pretty. I like the shape. Don't take it personally, Nyx. I like it. Oh, f dude, I fucked up that line. Oh no, dude, I messed up. I messed up. I messed up. Oh, I'm just goofing, thank god. Imagine Nyx unfollows unsubs. That'd be a big sag. I'd be sad. Nyx is a good shatter. A parasocial one, but still a good shatter. <laughs> okay, I kind of need to get your eyebrow shape. Dude, you look like... Thoughts on Mario Galaxy? <clears throat> hmm. I haven't played it. Oh my god! I'll answer, I'll answer your question in a second time. But thank you, Mac, for that gifted. I appreciate that. Starting this month off strong. Yeah, chat went crazy. King Elite dropped five. It was wild. I'll send you my PC copy. No, I have Mario Galaxy. I got it with the, um... You know the three game set? That Switch release, like, last year. With, um, SM64, Mario Sunshine, and then Galaxy. I got that set. So, Mario Galaxy is gonna be our next game. I was gonna drop five right now, but on mobile? Yeah, fuck mobile. Dude, I keep moving my goddamn Ethernet cable. I need to tape it to the floor. What about Galaxy 2? Uh, there's a difference? I don't know. Wait, can we get some wax in chat? <laughs> can we get some wax, guys? Remember the meta W in front of Chatter's names? Can we get some wax? It's an actual sequel? Huh? Hmm. What game is <laughs> <laughs> Uh, cause like, I'm watching Extra Emily's streams and she's playing all the Mari games. Like, I haven't been able to like, sit and watch. Cause she's, she's streaming so goddamn long. But... Dude, it's so hard to get face shapes right.
<laughs> we just win. That's so stupid. Okay, I was thinking about this last night. But... Do I, like, trash talk too much? Because, like, I'll watch back my VODs, and I, I talk- I name call a lot. And I-, I it's because I talk like that IRL with my friends. i am like, oh my god, you're so stupid, or you're dumb, or you suck. So, chatters, if it's ever too much, tell me, and I'll- I'll hold back. Because I do it way too much. Can I send you a mirror selfie? Sure. Matt, you can send me as many pictures as you want, and I pick one. I honestly think that's better. Because Nick sent me three, and I picked the best one that I felt like the easiest was dr to draw. So you don't have to send me just one. You can send me several, and I can comb through them. So that's totally fine. Okay, let's try and get the hair texture down. Anybody else struggle with drawing ears? Ears are so hard. I think as long as it's, there's a mutual understanding that it's not too serious, it's okay. Okay, that's good. Ears are whack, I agree. They are kind of whack. Okay, now let's try and get this texture down. I think what I want to do for filling in Nyx's hair, I kind of want to do like some black strokes to fill it in. But we got to get like the baseline shape down. There we go. Yeah, I think trash talk is funny. As long as there's, like, a mutual understanding that it's not, like, legit. And I feel like most people joining this stream, they understand that vibe, you know? Oh, I messed up that stroke. Added a bit too much weight to it. Oh, this pen is dying, that's why. Oh, no. Okay, I forgot to add the little stringies. Oopsie. I'm gonna make the strings on the jacket black to fix that mistake. That way nobody will know. Nobody snitch either. There we go. I fixed it. Nobody tell Nyx. Nobody at Nick. Nobody at Nick's in chat and tell them I fucked up. <clears throat> okay. Let's get to coloring now. I almost crumpled the card. I would have cried. In Minecraft. And IRL. Well, that line's kind of botched, too. <laughs> Ellipses. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna add a bit more weight to this line. You know, let's add some texture to the hair.
I think this is looking kind of cool. Yeah. <laughs> I took damage. Dude, the RP frog's going crazy right now. The way that I'm coloring this in is kind of like old cartoony type vibes. I like how the texture looks though. Make you my friend. <laughs> okay, I'm liking how this is looking. I actually really like the texture. Let's get one more close up so you guys can see it before I start coloring. I really like that. Okay, let's get to coloring. Okay, so you have kind of like medium brown hair. Oh, I found my sharpener, guys. I bought two sharpeners. And then I found one right after I bought two new ones. SMH. I knew it, I knew it, I knew it. And I know that I can't necessarily mail out these cards right now, but if I ever get to a point where like the art channel is successful and I can mail out my pieces and get a P.O. box, I will definitely reach out to people and get these cards mailed out to you. Even if you got a card back in May or June, I'll still make sure it gets sent out to you if you want it mailed to you. Because I know I'm not going to be able to go to any convention, or I don't think I even want to go to a convention for a long time. But, 
If I ever have the means to mail them out, I will. Oh, I forgot. Your first convention is next month? Nice. My first ever convention I went to a few weeks ago was Rose City Comic Con. It was alright. Like, it was kind of overwhelming at first, but it was still like a fun time overall. Oh, Nix, you changed your chat color. You also changed your badges. Hey, yo. Wait, now Nix is the same color as Mac. That's gonna be a problem. Uh oh. Now I think Mac has to find Nyx in order to claim that color back, huh? <laughs> Fixed. <laughs> I'm trying to see what these two colors look together because Nyx has somewhat like a medium pink lip. There we go, that's it. <laughs> Too late! <laughs> nice try. You thought you could avoid these fists? Can I just say I appreciate how the RP frogs are keeping the chat room active? I really do. <laughs> this is the most confusing RP ever. <laughs> it's obviously Pokemon RP. Avi. Nix, can I ask why in this picture you're sitting behind a bunch of squishmallows? Can I investigate further? you happen to be also a Disney adult? Gage. <laughs> no, they're not killing everyone. It's Pokemon RP.
That's the ultimate insult being called a Disney adult, really? I mean, I'm not a Disney adult at all, so I take no offense. I just like calling people that. They just put the vibe? Oh, okay. Got it, boss. Okay, right now I'm going over with this light blue, just to kind of blend. One, because I lost my blending color pencil. And also, this shade of blue is very light, so it won't really show through on when I fill in the white gaps with the lavender. Because their sweater is kind of like a bluish lavender, it's more blue than purple, but I don't have the right color. It's like a periwinkle, almost. I need to put these pens back. Really, is a piece I do transition? It's like mod check my streamer. See, like, if I am able to get that property right. For a face cam, it would be a whole wide angle of my whole studio. That way you can see all my supplies and shit. I think that'd be cool. Say to no streamer. <laughs> That'd be pretty epic, huh? Yeah, the new camera that I got that we tested out for the Mario Party stream, that is a wide angle and I can't adjust the angle. But it's fine. That'll be the art cam. Okay, I'm posting a new TikTok hold. It's uploading. Okay, so the background for Nix's photo, it was obviously a photo shoot. Because they are a superstar. But it looked like it was underwater, the way the light was cast in the background. So I'm going to try and do something similar. <laughs> By the way, you should buy a haunted house. It would make streams more interesting. Yeah, let's just put that into the budget, guys. <laughs> yeah, let me just buy a haunted house. That is so funny to me. That's so good. Oh, is it a reference? Is it bad? Uh oh. Did I say something bad? If I did, just don't acknowledge it and then clip me out of context. A dumb meme? Okay, memeing is fine.
Wee music! <laughs> the photos are from my depression era. Dude, I'm in my depression era. Hello, Mao. Oh my god, same sleigh. I think it's funny because you hear like a lot of older people like, oh my god, the current generation is so depressed and anxious. You know, my generation wasn't like that, but I feel like people are more open to talk about it now. In the sense of it's not necessarily as frowned upon if you do seek medical attention for any type of mental debilitation. They were they just coped in horrible ways. Yep. <laughs> exactly. Okay. Is this from Yoshi? I think so. Okay, the background isn't exactly how I like it, but I'm gonna fix it, I promise. I don't have a projector. I don't think I need one. I don't have a lot of wall space. So I can't really justify getting one. Okay, this is kind of fixing itself. Hold. I think I might have fixed it. Oh my god, J-Shot music? Holy. <laughs> I think holy is going to be my new favorite catchphrase. It's <laughs> so good.
Okay, I think I kind of saved it. I'm sorry if I'm ignoring you guys today. Like, I'm trying. But I have a lot of fucking cars to do today. Pink borders? That bad? <laughs> Oopsie. Okay, now the final touch. It's cute. Okay, good. Okay, I think this one's done. <laughs> final touch burning it? Oh my god, imagine. Where's my mouse? There it is. Ta-da! Thoughts? First card done. I like the texture on the hair. I think the black is a cool look. Ta-da! Once again, thank you, Nyx, for gifting five subs last night. Very cool. Let's go ahead and sign it. Actually, I'll sign them all at the end. Okay, next card. Who wants to go next? Whichever chatter is here, whoever types first, I'll do your card next. <laughs> like, I look nothing like that now. What do I have? Whoever wants to go next, type. Just be like, people, yo, me. Do you mind? You don't have a card, Lemon. Nice try. Nice try. If nobody claims, they're gonna do a random. I'm shuffling. I'm shuffling. I'm shuffling. Hey, okay, I chose a card. Pick a card, any card. We're doing Cokes next. Lurks a tad? Okay. Okay, we're doing Cokes next. Dude, Cokes' hair is so cool. I'm so jealous. You can do random? Yeah, I did random. You all took so long. Unless you're all on mobile, then... Oopsie. <laughs> Mod check code. It's okay, some people can't catch every stream. That's not a problem. You know, I don't think most of y'all wear makeup in these pictures. But I like to just give everybody, like, eyeshadow. <laughs> or, like, eyeliner. Um, I think the upcoming Meg Esports Playing With Viewers event is going to be Uno or Mario Party. I think it's on the 16th. It's a Sunday, but I did add it to my monthly schedule. Because we, we, we did play with viewers last night, but we didn't have anything formally planned. 
I don't think I want to do another Meg Esports event until I have like a good idea. I No, it was just last night. You just came in later, I think, Mix. You played Animal Crossing right before. Okay, let's now- we're gonna do the glasses perfectly. Oh, dude, that was almost perfect. so hard to do. I've decided to quit my job! Please don't do that. You know, you need to have income. That way you can support yourself. Don't do that. That'd be silly. You know, I quit my job and look where I'm at. I'm streaming. I'm gonna try and do big strokes because I want his hair to look or their hair to look slightly more geometric this month Those strokes are kind of interesting. Wait, why are you guys talking about doing crimes? Don't talk about crimes in my chat room. Don't do that. Bad chatters, bad chatters. Change the subject, please. <laughs> Porfa. You know, y'all can't be self-reporting. I'm going to try to make his hair look more illustrative this time. Showed you my peach outfit, please snap back. I don't have a Snapchat plot twist. I think Snapchat is so cringe and scary and bad. Oh, I forgot their mustache.
There we go. I'm just doing like single strokes. Yeah, see it's just single strokes for the hairlines. And their eyebrows. I can't forget. I always forget to draw eyebrows. <laughs> Bruh. Last month I forgot to draw Coke's eyebrows. <laughs> I think it's because when I look at my face, I never see my eyebrows because my glasses cover mine basically entirely. I just forget to draw goddamn eyebrows. Okay, I think all the inking is done. Let's go ahead and start coloring. How is chat? Hope y'all are doing good. I'm doing pretty good right now. I love the art streams because I can just chill. I think the line art is really good on this one. Personally. Dude, Coke's always looks so cool. Yeah, good luck with that application, Nix. I hope it goes well on. Okay, I think... I kind of want to keep the line aesthetic. So instead of doing base colors, I'll fill in with lines. You know, adding lines kind of defeats the blocky shape look I was going for, but I like the look of just filling in lines. I mean, I think incentive-based wages are better. Because, like, not that it necessarily improves your wages to a large degree. But I feel like it gives your work more meaning. Like, if you're getting it along with hourly wages, I think that's great. We have to do upstairs, but I never do it because I think it's dumb. Well, I would hate you if I were my if I was your manager. You know what else I hate? 
running ads on Twitch. But you know, I gotta do it because it's part of my Twitch contract. But, you can't even see my head. But, you can avoid that ad by subscribing for $4.99, just $5. Skip your coffee and get ad for viewing all month long. Or, you can link your Amazon Prime to your Twitch and hashtag sub for free with Prime every month. But isn't that pretty sick, guys? It's a $5 value. Just two clicks. See if you got a Prime available. 7 out of 10, screw you. 8 out of 10, thank you. That's a much better score. Base pay is 17? What the fuck? Yeah, if if that's on top of commission, that's insane if you get that. Bro. I would... Nope. I would love to have that type of wage. It's entry level. Fuck you, Nyx. Why are you giving me this? this? <laughs> now I feel bad. You know, all I do is show subs all day. That's my job. <laughs> okay, anyway, if you want to avoid that, I'll just subscribe. Easy clap. Get some water, get a snack. We'll see some of you guys in a few, but... <coughs> I breathed in wrong. Okay. If... You have to watch that ad, no problem. I just uploaded a new TikTok, so you can go like it, go leave a comment. I'd appreciate it. Okay, anyway, that ad is coming. Get some more, get a snack. Get screwed, non-subs. Okay, back to work. Back to making art. Nonsubs, Meg P and 17 just did something crazy and you missed it. <laughs> you realize when people watch an ad, they can still see the stream, they just can't hear it. So, you would just have to say, she said something insane. Yeah, non-subs can see the stream. <laughs> That's why whenever I see the code, I have to cover my mouth. Oh, Lamau. I mean, non-subs, I could have said something wild. Okay, let's go back to inking. <laughs> <laughs> hmm. I think I want to do just black and white for this one, and then one key color. I kind of want to do another red, white, and black card. I mean, Cokes, their color doesn't seem like it's red, though. They seem more like a blue type of guy. Okay, yeah, I'm going to keep coloring. <laughs> I'm gonna try something crazy for the shirt. Hi, Crystal. Welcome in. Hope we're doing well today, hon. Okay, so right now I'm just filling in the gaps I didn't fill in with the regular Sharpie with really close lines. So that way it's just not a solid black fill. Like, it's this weird texture, but I think it's kind of interesting.
I don't know if I like this line art now. Hi, Emmy. Peace, I too. Vibe. <laughs> I think Peace, I too. Vibe is another favorite of mine. I think it looks fine. It's an interesting texture, I guess. Hmm. I think I'll keep it for now. I might fill it in later, but I'm gonna keep it like this. <clears throat> hmm. This is why I like the sketch cards. You can, like, try obscure ideas, and if they work, it's cool. If not, then you didn't. it's not like you wasted, like, $10 worth of paint, you know? You like that? Thank you. I'm trying out different textures that I can try with black on this card. Because when I was initially thinking out what to do for, like, just the baseline sketch card concept, I wanted to do, like, a different theme or color scheme every month. But I felt like that was too restricting. Yeah, maybe I... Hmm. Okay, I think we're going to do a solid border. I think I'll do it all the way around. Kind of box it in. Oh, Emmy. If Emmy's still here. Uh, are you doing your stream tomorrow? <laughs> A Christmas stream? What day is Christmas on, even? Lots of gifted? Uh, I don't know. Can we watch the New Year ball drop together? <laughs> Guys, I don't know if I can stay up there late. I usually knock out pretty early on New Year's. You're doing it tomorrow? Okay, cool. If you need somebody to play games with tomorrow, Emmy, I don't know how long your stream is going to go, but I'll be free past probably like 3 p.m. tomorrow. We can talk about it later if you want to, if you need somebody, come on. Uh, what was it? A calendar! Let's see, Halloween day is a Monday. Thanksgiving is 24th, 25th, Thursday, Friday. Christmas is a Sunday. Hmm. I mean, what would you- okay. If we want to talk about doing, like, special streams for holiday, what would you guys want to do for holiday? <clears throat> wait, wait, what day is New Year's on? New Year's is a Sunday as well. You do Christmas on Christmas Eve? Interesting. What day is Halloween? I just said it! Dude, I literally just closed my app. Halloween is a Monday. Maybe we can play scary games. I don't want to play scary games, though. I'm gonna piss my pants. Okay, the border looks nice. I like that a lot. Oh, what day is Dia de los Muertos? Is that the day before or after Halloween? Mmm, Monday. Sounds delicious. Oh, we could do Christmas cookies. Ooh, gingerbread decorating stream. That'd be fun. A gingerbread house decorating stream. But I actually try hard and do a really pretty gingerbread house. I feel like with Christmas, there's like a lot of different stream ideas you can do. So like we can do like a week of Christmas. Like theme shit near the end of the month. <clears throat> But I don't know what to really... Oh, wait, for Halloween, we could do pumpkins. Avi. Should we do a... Should we do a candy tier list? But then I have to buy a fuck ton of candy. Dude, I'm already fat. <laughs> Nobody told me I'm fat. You're gonna get banned? Oh, no. 
I was gonna say, I could do like a Kit Kat tier list because I have a whole bunch of like Japanese. <laughs> Kick Ouija board share. Dude, I'm never doing a fucking Ouija board. You cannot make me do it for any amount of money. I am never doing a goddamn Ouija board stream. One, because my mom would kill me in Minecraft. Because she believes in that shit. So she finds out that I did a Ouija board in this house? Oh no. I'd be done for. Also, like, I don't necessarily believe in ghosts or spirits or that type of shit, but, like, if it is real, I don't want to fuck with it, you know? Yeah, we could do a Halloween week where we do pumpkins, candy tier list, and then scary game. That sounds good. Because then we get our three streams for the week. That sounds good. <clears throat> okay. Hmm. Should I add anything else? I kind of like this just on its own. Hmm. I like it. Thank you. I'm trying to think. I kind of want to, like, add something to the background, but I kind of like the solid white. I'm thinking, I'm thinking. I'm not stalling, I'm thinking. Maybe I can just fill in the background with gray. I can do like a background with gray sharpie. I think that will be nice. I'll do that, I'll do that. That way it's still like the monochrome look. I'll just do like lines to fill in, but diagonal, because I feel like it's too much empty space. I can do like a wood texture maybe. Yeah, see, this is looking a lot better. Yeah, I love that gray. That gray was a good decision. If anybody disagrees, you can keep your opinions to yourself. <laughs> Something like Luigi's Mansion? I was going to do like a full playthrough of Luigi's Mansion anyway. I think I kind of want to do a one-off game for like a Halloween stream. Like, I can probably play some, like, indie game or something. <clears throat> Costume making stream? I don't know how to sew. That, that would actually be a horrible stream. You would just hear the... Oh, wait, I can't make the sound. Like, you know, the do, 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 the sewing machine. I don't think that'd be an enjoyable stream to watch. You know I'm genuinely scared of- if I do pumpkin carving, I'm scared that I'm like, cut my finger open, because my hands aren't strong anymore. Or maybe I can do like, pumpkin painting. You could have such a cool holiday stream. But w what would we do? Because, like, I also need to think of, like, budget. Because I gotta buy shit. And I don't have money. Oh, we're doing Cult of the Lamb tomorrow. Tune in tomorrow. 11 a.m.
Because, like, we talked about this yesterday, but... To me, someone that makes a good content creator or streamer is, like, if you give them a budget, well, they make good shit. But it's, like, I have a very small, basically, budget of zero. So, like, I have to... Keep in mind what I buy for stream. Because if I do move out, any money from stream would have to go towards, like, paying for my rent, paying for groceries and that shit. So I'd have less for stream. That's why we donate? True. But I, I can't rely on donations for everything. That's the problem. Tree decorating? Hmm. That could be cool. We could do... T <laughs> 24 hour? You log stream. Ta-da! I think this one's done. Oh, the gray looks nice. That looks really nice. I'm glad I filled that in. Ta-da! Ooh, we can make ornaments! Like, y you know how they sell, like, the clear glass bulbs? I could decorate ornaments. <laughs> That'd be cool. <clears throat> Somebody needs to write these down. <laughs> but there we go. Coax's card is now done. Thank you, Coax, for gifting five subs during the month of September. Thank you. Okay, time for the next card. Let's choose one from the pile. You can react to spooky YouTube videos. That'd be a good one. We have five cards left. Oxen free? What is that one sounds really familiar. Let me look that one up. Cause, Cause like I wanna play a game that I haven't seen or played myself, you know? Oxen free. That sounds so familiar. How many hours is it? Ten dollars, that's fine. Four and a half hours for main story. Okay, I'm gonna write that down. Because if that one is four hours, then we can do a one-off stream of that. Okay, I have to write that in my notes. Because ideally, I want to do a game that we can finish in one stream. Because I don't want to add any games to, like, our roster if it's story-driven, right? Thank you, Nix. Great suggestion. Yeah, so if y'all know any other, like, short, story-driven games that are, like, four-ish hours or less, tell me. Okay, we're picking another card. We got Mac next. Pog you. Okay, so Mac is the only card that I chose to do somewhat cartoonish and stylized. Okay, I think I could just go ahead and start inking. <laughs> Whack. <laughs> okay, let's get going. Okay, this eye shape is kind of fucked. It's over. It's over. Okay, I know Mac doesn't wear makeup, but I'm gonna... 
make the eyeliner a bit artsy. You know, Mac is gonna look kind of emo. Corpse parties like 10 hours? Yeah, that's. <laughs> I don't think I can stream that long. That was a bit much. What if we gave Mac an eyebrow slit? That'd go kind of crazy. Yeah, because, like, I want to start doing more illustrations. But it's just hard because I don't have an established style yet. Let's get a close-up of the face details. I like the eyes came out cool. <laughs> okay, now let's go in with the hair. shape is cool. Oh, I fucked up that stroke. I'm gonna fill in majority of these with black though, so it'll be negligible. before my pride did become available yeah the moment you link your amazon prime to your twitch account you get a badge but hi cokes oh i just finished your card hun here's yours i chose to go black and white because i wanted to focus on line art but there's yours cokes we just finished it but you can see i fucked up the symmetry on the hair because see that's way too low that's that's way too low. I'm gonna have to fill it in. It's way too low. I'm gonna white it out. Damn. Damn, damn, damn. Nobody snitch. Nobody tell Mac that I fucked up. Nobody tell them. This is gonna take several layers of white out, though. Oh, I'm not full cam. Lamau. Hair isn't symmetrical. It's fine. No, it's like way too long. That's the problem. I did the stroke way too long. It, do it matters to me, okay? Because with stylized work, every single line and stroke has to have a meaning behind it. Like, you can't just willy-nilly make lines and expect it to look good. It'd be cool if I made their hair look like clouds. That'd be artsy. Okay, let's fix it now. There we go. That looks a lot better now. It was way too... It was sagging. It was sagging.
Okay, I'm gonna tuck the hair back here. Okay, this part looks really messy. I'm gonna fill this in just to fix that spot. Cause it looks fucked. It looks janky as hell. Where's my white out? Right here? <laughs> oh, you're looking for a bit? I appreciate the lurk though. <laughs> Sorry, the W meta is so funny to me. <laughs> I can't punch right now. I know. That's what I hate about the Prime subs. I wish they auto-renewed. Because I personally give my Prime to Connor Eats Pants. So I know the moment I don't have my Among Us emote, that's when my Prime expired. Do you need a sub? No, Cokes has a prime, I think. It just renews probably in like a few hours. I'll punch for you. <laughs> okay, now I gotta figure out how to fill in the hair. It's similar to the previous one, I kinda wanna do- oh, fuck. I didn't realize the white wasn't fully dry. Damn it. I kind of want to do black and white with one accent color. <laughs> I know I can count on you to punch! Time to put you another closing shift. Dude, I fucking hate closers when they don't do their shit. <laughs> but bye, Nyx. Thank you for hanging out today. Hope you have a good day. Good luck at work. And also, good luck with that new application. I really hope you get it. Because honestly, 17 an hour? Sounds pretty banging. Let's see how this will look. Because I kind of wanted the hair to stand out. And I guess be the focal piece. It'll be bold. I would do like fully rendered like watercolor portraits. But that would take... Literally all day. 
So I think like a full watercolor portrait would probably take like an hour to two per card. So that's why like I'm doing like more simpler mediums like pen and ink or color pencil. It's just a matter of time. And also like I don't want to undervalue my time. Because of five subs I get a portion of the actual dollar amount people spend. Like, maybe in the future we can do higher incentive portraits, but... I think at this time I gotta keep it where it's at. How much would a watercolor card cost? Well, one to two hours of work is... A lot more than five gifted subs, let's put it that way. Because, like... The thing with subscriptions is that streamers get a portion of the actual dollar amount because Twitch gets their percentage. Like, I can't say the specific amount I get, but it's around 10-ish dollars I get for every card. We'll put it that way. And ten dollars for a fully fleshed, rendered watercolor portrait is far from enough. That's why if we were to do like more elaborate incentives, I'd have to do them differently. Twenty gifted, but then that'd only be like twenty dollars. Oh wait, no, fuck. That's the wrong math. <laughs> I, I thought it. Never mind. Wait, 20? That'd be like. 4 times 5. So that'd be about 40. Yeah, 20 gifted would be about the amount, but I, I ain't doing that yet. <laughs> so don't you dare do it, Kobobo. I'm watching you. You already gifted a lot last month, so you're not allowed to do more than you need to this month. You're banned from gifting. Okay, I think the texture is kind of cool. And then I'm going to fill in with lines. I was going to do color, but I think color would be a bit much. Papa has a trigger finger on the gift button. I know, that's why I'm scared. I think that texture looks kind of cool. That's rad. Thank you. Okay, so they were wearing a sweater, so I kind of want to do like a stitch type pattern almost. And now we're going in with line art. This is going to take a bit. Yeah. 
Is this sub only? This stream? This isn't everybody's stream. If I'm doing a sub only stream, the title it would say in the title. Hi hacker. Welcome in, hun. Hope we're doing well. Cause I'm very much a big fan of even if your line order is very simple, you can still add texture without doing fully rendered shading. I'm a huge advocate because I fucking hate doing full renders. <laughs> Wacker stuff. Guys, you need to. <laughs> Someone's gonna come in and think we're calling people crazy. Never read the title. <laughs> Good one. I mean, I assume most of the regular channels don't look at the title. They probably just click on the go live notification, right? Because I feel like most regular chatters would watch anything I do, <laughs> which is kind of nice, but then it's also like I need to push myself and like do more creative things. Like, if I had a bigger budget, I would love to do more just chatting type streams and, like, have, like, a planned bit of that type of jazz, but I just don't have that right now. You don't have notifications on, really? Huh? Why would you not have notifications on? That's kind of rude. Then how do you get in stream so quickly? Do you just have Twitch open? Cause as of recent Cobalt, we were like, oh, like one of the first few in the just starting soon screen. Yeah, notifications sometimes take forever to be pushed out. They typically take an hour for most users. But there was one time I didn't get a notification until like two hours after somebody was live and I was like annoyed. I was like, really Twitch? Why you do this to me? To my favorite streamer, Azan. Kind of rude. I refreshed the time frames you see here going live. Oh my god, you're crazy. Yeah, I agree. Twitch Mobile has been ass recently. I mean, I know I prefer to watch on desktop, but if I don't have my computer booted up, or if I'm like in bed, I'll watch on mobile. Maybe they're just trying to get people to watch on desktop more. I don't know. Cause like a lot of the new functions, like the betas, they're pushing now for like the direct cheers, um, elevated chat, follow cues, all that type of jazz. It doesn't work on mobile. I mean, I think it's because if you're watching Twitch on desktop, you're more likely to stay on the website, that's why. Because you're on your phone, it's easy to swipe up and close the app. But if you're on desktop, you're more likely to explore, you're more likely to go on the Discover tab. Okay, the sweater texture is taking forever. But you know, I don't mind it because it looks cool.
Yeah, Twitch fix the app, please. Wowee. Look at that texture. Oh, wowee wowza. Chatters, did you know? Picture in picture mode if you're watching on mobile doesn't count as a viewer. Isn't that kind of weird? I mean, I don't care. But it's still interesting. Oh, wowzer. <laughs> really? Yep. Yep. It's stupid. That's why, like, if anybody streams, you can see, like, your users in chat. Like, you can see who's watching. Um, like, for example, if somebody is watching picture in picture, it still shows up in that users list. But it doesn't count as a viewer. It's stupid. I know, it's dumb. Like, I only learned this recently. Yeah, I don't care. I don't care, because that's just how, like, the, the platform is, but it's still dumb that that isn't expressed. Like, I've, I've, I've expressed multiple times. I don't care about my viewer count to a massive degree, but it's kind of stupid that- Because I know I watch Twitch. <laughs> I watch Twitch and picture picture mode all the time, because, like, I'll do other shit on my phone. You still get channel points when you come back? Yeah. Like, it, like you said, it, it counts as, like, user watching, but it doesn't, it doesn't count as a live viewer. Yeah, it gives you channel points, still. Hi, Cass. Wait, you know what? I'm creeping? Oh, my. Yeah. Lomo. <laughs> Hi, Cass. Hope you're doing well today, hon. <laughs> Let's all switch to picture in picture, but to see if it's really true. <laughs> I don't care. <laughs> it's just an interesting fact. Hey, yo. Hi, Cass. Oh, wait, Cass. I don't know if you were in stream near the end, but I wrote your name since you're here. You're not here often, so. Castifer. It'll be on Twitter later. Imagine my viewer count goes down to zero. <laughs> Looks amazing. Thank you. Did you change your name again? Because now you're red. You used to be blue last night. Why do you keep changing your name color? Kind of cringe. <laughs> yeah, what should I do next? I don't know what else to add. Okay, I'm just making the lines on this headphone cable. A bit less defined. You can change your name color? Yeah. Did you not know that? Hey, trolling. Hey, trolling. Wait, Mac, you have blue eyes? You're lying. They're brown, right? You had no idea? Well, if you click in, I think, the bottom left corner of your chat box, it has chat identity. That's where you can choose what badge you have and also what color. No them out. I hate Mac. In Minecraft. Mac is whack. Can we make that the new chat matter? Mac is Mac is whack. Mac is very whack. Okay, I almost forgot their piercing. There. Oh that looks stupid. That looks so- I need to touch up that line. That's so bad. It looks like a blob. Okay, that looks a little bit better. <laughs> okay, what should I do now? I'll color in the background. Actually, it's not wet. If anything, it can be a mole. I keep on finding new, like, 
I call them pretty spots. Like, I have so many on my arm. It's a sign of skin cancer. <laughs> or it's just normally how your skin ages. No need to worry, Chatters. Totally normal. Oops, wrong scene. Call them beauty marks, yeah. My mom calls them pretty spots. I think dirty blonde hair is personally really pretty. I know blonde hair is very difficult to manage, but I think it's cool how the color changes throughout the year. You actually have a pretty spot that right next to the piercing? That's cool. She got a double piercing. <laughs> okay, now I'm gonna fill in the background with just like a light blue pattern. Okay, let's get started. I've been debating using purple shampoo. Is that like the type of shampoo that dyes your hair? I don't think I could ever dye my hair. Like, my parents don't care, but... I don't know if I could fully commit to a hair color change. Okay, this looks kind of cool. Oh, it's a temporary dye? That could be kind of fun to try out if it's temp. Because, see, like, I did lines closer together here and then wider at the top. I think I want to do another little row of lines in between each one. That way it kind of fills in a bit more space. A self promo McDonald's, not in my chat. <laughs> I almost said it. Okay. Doesn't look kind of look cool with the darker blue in the bottom. I'm trying to think. I don't know what I should do. Because this is supposed to be like a headphone cable, but see how it ended here when it should go like here behind the ear? I think I'm gonna go in and just like use the white pen to kind of like draw in the cable. Has Inktober started yet? I mean, Inktober has started. I'm not doing it. This is way too much work. And I don't think I can commit to like a fully rendered drawing every day. That's a bit much. weird though I 
don't know if I like it. Mm. I think I'm gonna cover it, cover it a little bit, cause I don't like it. Looks weird. It looks weird. Maybe because like the line width is too heavy. Right now I'm covering some of the black outer line with white to make it thinner. I think that'll fix it a little bit. Okay, I think that makes it a little bit better. I like that's a half body card. I think it's because Max's hair is so big. I didn't want to do a full head card again. Because Max card last month, let's see. Yeah, it's over here. Max card last month was a full head one, and I didn't want to do that again. <laughs> oh no. Oopsie. <laughs> okay, well, I think Max card is done. Let's get a close up. I still think the headphone cable looks weird. I think it's because you can't see their ear. Because, like, it just looks like it tucks into their hair. Some with your hair back? That'd be great. You know what I want to do? I, cause like, I usually wear my hair up all the time. My hair is really heavy. Like, I've, I've had a few people ask me if I want to like shave this part back here. Cause like, I wear my hair up all the time anyway. I think it'd be a cool look. Okay, there we go. Thank you, Mac, for gifting more than five subs last month. I think I gifted like nine or ten or something. But thank you, Mac. Okay, let's see who is next. We have four left. Game 11, thank you for the 11. I updated my Twitch panels, that way people can see last month's leaderboards. Let's see. Oh, it's Kobobo next, ayo. Hey, okay, let's get to work. The background's amazing, thank you. I try. Now it's Kobobo's turn. I think Kobobo's came out the best, like, sketch-wise. Like, I think I got the forms pretty good. Why? I'm not gonna start off with my Sharpie. That'd be dumb. <laughs> Whoa, Bobo! Yeah, I think Coke saw their card. Because they said they were lurking for a bit as I was drawn. Okay, let's actually remember to give Kobobo eyebrows this time. Sure you sent me cool bubble because your eyes were big. You look so cool. It looks so punk. 
I'm glad you like it, Cooks. You, you know what my nightmare is? My legit nightmare is I do a card and somebody hates it. That's my nightmare. Chatters, if you genuinely don't like it, tell me. Tell me. Not that I'll remake it, but just tell me and then <laughs> I'll do better next time. Because, like, I feel like some cards come up better than others, but it's, like, a thing where you have- I have an idea in mind, and then I commit to the idea, and then I don't like it. You think ours are small? In this picture, they looked really big. And it's also, like, the angles, too. And, like, when you look at yourself in, like, a selfie camera or in a mirror, it looks drastically different than how you look IRL or how other people perceive you. I hate my card. Well, you haven't even gotten a card. Demands a refund. You'll have to go through Twitch for that. Yeah, what are eye injections? That sounds scary. I can't even put contacts in my eyes. I'm such a fucking wimp. Understand that cosmetic surgeries are fine and everybody has the right to do what they want with their body but I know for me I don't think I ever want to get any type of surgery that'll change how I look because you know I was raised to appreciate how I look and because of that I'm very self-confident even if I'm not conventionally attractive But it took a while to gain that confidence. Yeah, that sounds scary. I don't think I could ever do that shit. Any type of surgery or procedure sounds scary. Like, I've never been under, but I'm generally scared if I ever have to. Hopefully I won't need to, but it's probably gonna happen. Okay, let's make sure I don't fill in the strings this time. Yeah, I ain't never getting surgery for cosmetic shit. Too scared. Cause like, what if they botch it and then you look fucked up? Nothing you really do.
Yeah, I think it's weird when people repost their kids. Like, being under the influence of, like, uh, Novocaine. I think it's concerning. Anyway, we got the liner done for a cool bobo. All the people in plastic surgery shows are annoying. I'm not gonna say I agree, but it's a pretty true statement. Oh, I'm not on Arkham Limo. I made this line way too thick right here. I have to fix that. Probably add weight to other lines. Yeah, I know when I was younger, like, I hated when my parents would post pictures of us on Facebook. Especially on my teen years, because that's when you're, like, cognizant enough to understand why your parents are doing what they're doing. And, like, obviously, anytime you post pictures of your kids, you're going to get lots of likes and comments. I don't like how... Because, like, I would adamantly tell my parents, like, you know, I don't want you to post pictures of me. They're like, well, I'm the adult. It just feels like they're disrespecting your personal boundaries and don't respect you over time. Like, the moment I turned 18, I told my mom, I was like, do not post pictures of me anymore. I don't give a shit. I don't care if I'm living in your house. Like, just don't post pictures of me anymore. And, like, every birthday, she'd be like, can I please post a picture of you and your birthday cake? I was like, no, you can post pictures of the cake, but not of me. <laughs> I remember my friends saw my mom's Facebook and I was mortified. I mean, at that point, it's GG's. <laughs> nah. Like, all my mom stuff is private, I think, so... I feel like people post way too much personal shit on Facebook. It's kind of concerning. Because people feel like Facebook is quote-unquote a more secure platform in terms of, like normies won't find you or just your friends will see your post, but some can always always easily like screenshot and repost whatever you say. Like you know how there's like racist people exposed and then people find like their Indeed or their LinkedIn or their Facebook. You can never be fully anonymous online. It's so easy to search your name and find it. I know. That's why I don't have anything sus post on my Facebook. And I privated everything, I think. I hope I did, right? <laughs> you should also never post pictures of your house online. Even if you think just your friends are going to see it. Just for your own privacy and security. Because, like, even if you don't have a platform, there's obviously people who are going to try and, like, human traffic you. And uh, people don't realize it. You love that light blue? Thank you. It's a turquoise. <laughs> My username is just your name. I don't think... Is that really, like, your full name? I don't think so, right, Cass? Because I, I don't think I've ever heard the name Castifer. It sounds very, like, royal almost. Okay, right now I'm going over with a very light blue to blend in and fill in any white space.
Oh, Christopher Cass? Oh. That's interesting. Well, you didn't have to tell me. <laughs> you know, I didn't like you like. That's cool. That's a cool nickname. Or I guess user. I just think it's cringe when people put like their whole last name as their like username. Like you see it so much on like Nintendo. Where their their Nintendo name is like Bob. Or John. It's really funny to me. What color are your eyes, Cole Bobo? Are they like green? They either look green or hazel. I'll do the hair first. I need to decide my outfit. You should look cool. You should look wicked. Blue? Okay. But also keep in mind these are portrait cards, and portraits are usually chest up. So I'm not gonna get your full fits. And I I'm not good at drawing clothes. I will tell you now, I am not good. Oh my god, Mario Kart! I love drawing accessories, you know, like earrings and necklaces. I personally don't wear them all the time. But I really love accessories. Let's draw like your upper one. It'd be cool if somebody had like a face tattoo or something. Anybody want to get one in time for next month's portrait cards? <laughs> Mod chick, anybody? You, said. You, you heard me. You heard me. I know you heard me. <laughs> I think I'm gonna I'm gonna try and have the best of compilation done by Tuesday. So I'm probably gonna edit it on Monday. That's my goal. I could do it like tomorrow night, but I'm not sure. Or maybe even tonight, but. Wait, I didn't run an ad! Shatters, we are more than three hours in the stream. I'm like, Twitch is gonna get really mad. This is Twitch right now. They're really mad. They're like, my why is my streamer, Peace and 17, not running ads? I'm sorry, but non subs, you're gonna get fucked because. <laughs> I have to fulfill my contractual obligation and run a few minutes of ads, but you can avoid that ad by subscribing for four ninety nine, just five dollars. Skip your coffee and get ad free viewing all month long. Uh, you can also link your Amazon Prime to your Twitch. You can hashtag sub for free with Prime. Guys, it's free. See if you got a Prime available. Click the subscribe button and check. After the ad, we're gonna continue the sketch cards. We have Kobobos, and we got three more left. So probably three, two or three more hours of stream. So anyway, get some more good snack. We'll see some of you guys in a few. Why did nobody tell me it was three hours uptime? That's your guys' job. No one, I, nobody debated me for the ad today. Come on. If I forget, you have to tell me. The switch gets really mad. 
No, I don't think they give a shit for affiliates. Because, <laughs> like... Because, like, affiliates don't... <laughs> they don't garner a lot of revenue from ads anyway. Accidental 24 hour stream are bad. Wait, why would that happen though? What what would what would trigger that to occur? What's an ad? Uh I don't know, ask your mom. <laughs> How would you guys make a 24 hour stream happen? The only time you guys could trigger that is if we get a subathon again. Which is not gonna be for a while. Oh, you literally can't see this color at all. Oh no. I thought this color would be darker. Damn, it's kinda like a goldenrod gray. But it's not showing up at all. Hmm. So that I guess no. Our place is very secure. Next year could do subathon. Well, I'm gonna do a subathon every year for my stream anniversary, no matter what. So no matter where I'm at, I do it. 24 minute stream, do it. I like the sound of that. Wait, what if what if the concept was I did a reverse subathon and the timer starts at 12 hours and every sub I get takes away time? But then I don't think people would subscribe, right? I'm trying to find a different color brown. Okay, this one's a bit dark, but it's like the best I can do. Okay, right now I'm just doing strokes, similar to how we filled in Nyx's hair, to kind of define where the darker and lighter areas would be. <laughs> non-subs are cooked. <laughs> yeah, non-subs get fucked, because it's either, um... <laughs> yeah, when I did my subathon on August 2nd, there was a 12-hour cap, and then we hit 7. Uh, what was I gonna say? Yeah, because I have to run three minutes of ads every hour. So I can either do like a minute every 20, a minute 30 every 30 minutes, or three minutes every hour. And I personally hate when any stream gets interrupted too many times. That's why I do three an hour. And also, if I do three every hour, then that allows ample time for chatters to go to the bathroom to get a snack. It gives me time to use the restroom if I need to. Because a minute 30 is not enough time to, like, wash your hands after you use the bathroom, right? So, that's why I do three every hour. So, basically, non-subs get cooked. And how much does one sub add? Well, when we did our subathon in August, one sub was five minutes. But then every hour we had a, a five minute window where all subs would be donated or doubled. So. Like if you gifted a sub, it'd be worth 10 minutes instead of five. Okay, I need to change my ISO. Hold. Oh, much better. There you go. So you can sign, you can sign it. You can kind of see the texture on the hair now. It's like a chevron type pattern. I'd only stream. I don't think you can do that. 
because you can only run an ad every 15 minutes, I believe. But that'd be a good concept, huh? I mean, who would watch that? <laughs> okay. Now it's time to do the background. What color would look good with turquoise? Maybe pink. I'm thinking pink would look good. I would, of course you would, Mac. You're you're a fucking simp. Who <laughs> me if it's actually interesting ads? What if I recorded a bunch of like fake ads, like infomercial ads? And that was the concept. Okay, I know what I'm doing. I'm doing pink for the background. If you don't like pink, then oopsie. I already have pink over here, don't I? Yeah, it's right up here. It's right up here. I have such bad memory, me too. I mean, August fe feels like ages away. Like, it does not feel like October. Hey, yo, one stroke right there. You guys see that? That's perfect. Yeah, I love the ads that have lore. Those are the best, because like it actually kind of makes it feel worthwhile. And like, I actually have to pay attention to it. And then you get kind of excited to see what the next ad is. Bubblegum fantasy? That's why I love blue and pink together. It's bubblegum. It's cute. Okay, I have an idea. I'm gonna do circles. Connected like this. And then do a lighter pink circle in between. Oh well, yeah, like the old Lucky Charms commercials? Those were good. They did have lore. Oh shit. I love the Wii music. Maybe instead of doing like, let me go full Kim. Instead of like filling in the whole background with circles, I could do like a line here and then empty space and then more circles up top. I think that'd look good. Was there any. Like, Wii Sports minigame where you did play an instrument? I think the closest was the marching one, right? But you would just be holding the baton.
They had a game for that. Was the rhythm one? Yeah, I think the closest was the marching band one. Yeah, I know the marching band was the Wii Fit because you had to like step on the board and use like the nunchucks. I hated that one. <laughs> Gifting subs with us without the September discount is sad for my bank account. I know. I'm gonna miss September. But it will be back next year. I think during the month of September, I gifted... I think a total of like 20. Before and after the discount total. It's called Wii Music? There was a game called Wii Music? No way. Wait. Let me look that up. Yeah, if I move, we're gonna have Wii streams, guys. Wii Music Game. What? Oh, it's like you have your Mii's play instruments. How'd it work, though? Oh, it's a rhythm game. Okay. That seems kind of fun. We can add that to the list. I found one. It said used, though. Which I don't mind getting used games. Okay, instead of doing, like, bubbles on the top and bottom, I think just, like, doing it to, like, here would look better. Yeah, if I can get the Wii set up, then I'm totally down for doing, like, older Wii games. Dude, Wii Fit streams will go crazy. I remember playing the Wii Fit when I was younger. And, like, I've been overweight for a majority of my life ever since puberty. So, like, fourth grade, I've always been overweight. And I remember, because you would do, like, the fitness test every day. And they would say my character's obese. And it's funny, because the sound would be like, do 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 Whenever you'd be overweight. <laughs> it's so funny. I mean, like, it didn't bother me too much because I understood that I was a heavyweight, but... Dude, is there a way to see how many games you played an hour on the Wii? Or how many hours you played a game on the Wii? I probably had, like, a million hours. The board was so mean and for what? You know, maybe that's just how the board lives. It's so sad, it has to make other people sad. Yeah, I have a Wii U. Actually, my friend gave it to me. For free. I don't know how to set it up, though. Okay, instead of using the Sharpie, I think we're going to fill in these bubbles with colored pencil and then leave the top white. I'll do that. They would- oh yeah, I remember. Like, they would send it to, like, the little mailbox in games. So like, oh, you played this game for one hour and then this game for two yesterday. I do remember that.
Yeah, this is kind of a salmony pink and I regret it, but you know, I gotta commit. So it's the only pink color pencil I have that's not like too dark. Maybe I can fill in the top with the pink. Here, let's look in the full camera real quick. Should I leave the top white or fill in with the border pink? I think I should fill in with the pink. I think that'd look good. Hmm. Use your 3DS more than the Switch? What's wrong with you? The Switch is amazing. Dude, I want a DS so bad. That's one of my go-to things that I always wanted for Christmas, but it was always too expensive. Like, I remember when we were getting the Switch, it was either we can get a DS or a Switch. But my sister wanted a Switch, which is a good decision. Yeah, I think filling in would look good. Cause then like the border becomes part of the background. Hmm. Yeah, I guess you're right. A DS is more portable than a Switch. Okay, let's fill in the background with pink. Okay, the fill is going to be a bit messy because it is marker, but we're going to work with it. We're going to say it's texture. I'm going to go over one more time to kind of fill in. Make the border darker, maybe. There we go. Oh, you guys are talking to each other. Okay, I was like, whoa, I missed a lot in chat. Okay. I think this one's done. Okay, the pink background looks more like a solid fill and on cam, but it's a bit, like, streaky. But that's what happens when you color marker. I think this one's good. Thoughts? Mache Koboba, what do you think? It would be cool if I could, I could add like glitter. We can make like hollow cards. Dude, that'd go crazy. Oh, you'd make a collage of the cards? That'd be so cute. That'd be adorable. You love it? Thank you. I think this one would make a better profile pic, because, like, I feel like your first card, Cold Bobo, like, the, uh, the butterfly idea was cool, but it didn't come out as nice. There we go. You got Cold Bobo's card for September. We have three cards left. Mmm! 
Hmm, interesting. We have one of Titan's cards. Now, Titan sent me, like, meme images. So I think for this card, I'm gonna do, like, a scribble-type drawing. So it's gonna be more illustrative. It's gonna have, like, a messy, intentionally messy look. Yes, I'll, I'll send you a nice picture on Twitter, blah, 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 of course. It chatters. I'm gonna post all the cards on a Twitter post later today, probably. But if you want, like, a nice quality, like, close-up picture, DM me on Twitter and just say I would like a close-up picture or some shit like that. And I'll send you a nicer picture. Okay? <sighs> okay, let's get to inking. So, this one is going to be very illustrative. I'm going to try and do, like, looser strokes. I would show the picture Titan sent me, but I don't want to leak anything. So, let's see. How do I want to do this? Okay, I'm going to use different widths. No leakers. This one's going to be interesting. I can promise you that. That's kind of cool. You guys can't tell. So zoomed out. But I drew this moving line outside and it connects to that ear line. Do you see? That actually looks cool. That's a really nice touch. I like that a lot. I dropped the other two cards. I don't know if chatters know this. But I had a face like a year ago, 
before I started streaming where I like to do calligraphy or caricatures for fun. I kind of want to get back to into it. I think a caricature stream with viewers would be kind of fun. Goggles on what? How would that work? We would either pull people into like a Discord video call or get people to send pictures, and then I draw caricatures. Cause like caricature work, like the line ones, like the line art ones, they're very quick. But like I would want, I'd want to do like at least ten in one stream. Because it'd be like 10 minutes per. That'd be about a two hour stream. I'd be down for that. <laughs> Big forehead would be my dividing feature. <laughs> See, that's another thing. I don't want people to get like mad or self conscious if I draw shit. Ooh, the aging lines. This one actually looks really cool. It's gonna. I'm gonna erase the pencil lines, then we can get a close up. I like how this one looks. I love doing stylized shit. This one actually looks really cool. I really like this one. This might be my favorite of today. Because I like using big strokes. They're really expressive. Oh, I really like this one. That looks really cool. Like, it doesn't really look like him, but... Because the ref picture he sent me was, like, a filtered picture. So it was, like, obviously distorted proportions. I'm going to fill in the glasses. Also, for art streams chatters, I'm going to be using a different camera for a close-up of the painting. Because this camera that we use for calligraphy is not nearly high res enough. We're going to be using the new camera that I got for our streams.
Okay, I'm gonna try and touch up these lines a little bit, get them a bit cleaner. Because I don't want them to be as thick a stroke. Okay, I kind of want to sketch out the inner shapes I want to do here. Oh, hey yo! Thank you for that three month resub, Kobobo. I appreciate that. You're gonna get your name written at the end of the stream. Thank you. <laughs> you put. <laughs> You're so funny. <laughs> you put in the. Oh, thank you for the lore coax. I appreciate it. <laughs> You're so funny. Oh, I just had a message for it to show. Yeah, it doesn't show up as an alert. Unless you share the resub message in chat. It's kind of D-U-M. But thank you for that resub. I appreciate it. Sorry, I, I am not looking at chat as much and I feel bad. Because it's like once you get in the mood for art, you just want to stay in it. Hey, yo. Chatters. Holy, we got a raid. Pog you. Thank you, Titans. We're actually working on your card right now. But thank you, Chatter Chatters. Can we get some peace side to yo's? Why is the command not working? Hey, yeah, there it is. Chatters, can we get some peace side to yo's? Welcome in, Titans. Hope we're doing well. What game did you play? Hello. <laughs> Chatter Chatters, can we get some peace side to yo's or peace to vibes for Titans? Peace I to, yeah. Peace I. Oh, I spelled peace. I put. There we go. Are you playing Mario Galaxy 2? Nice. You were just talking about that in chat earlier, right? Oh, cool. Uh, don't feel obligated to stay, hun. Take some rest if you need to. I know streaming is tiring. But thank you for bringing your folks over here. That's why you were asking, Lomo. <laughs> okay. 
I have the base shapes down now. I think I should color on the shirt black, but I don't know. Let's get a close up. So if you're just coming in, chatters. Anybody who gifted five subs during the month of September gets a custom portrait card drawn. That's what we're working on right now. This looks really cool. This is actually yours, Titans. This is like the filtered image you sent me, and I tried to keep the anatomy the same. I think it looks really cool. Hmm. I, I don't like how this part of the hair looks, though. It looks really flat. I wish I would have made the line like here. But that's how the picture was. Hmm. It makes me look better than the other one does. <laughs> Low no. Okay, I think I want to color in the background with red. Or maybe yellow. I think yellow would be kind of cool. Hmm. Or maybe we can do warm colors. So red, orange, red. Or red, orange, yellow. I think I'll do that. I think I'll do the hair orange, shirt red, and then background yellow. Because I think, even though the black and white looks good, like the lines are really expressive, I think I need to fill it in. I've done too many black and white pieces today. I need to add some color. Like, I rely too heavily on black and white for a lot of my pieces because, like I said, I think line work on its own is fairly expressive and impactful. But it's not professional quality if you don't add color. I'm sharpening my pencils right now. Like, this is actually the sharpener that my high school art teacher gave me. It's a stapler. It's like the hand crank ones. Once Art Channel hits affiliate, will people who get five get something else? Yes. I'm still thinking about what I want to do for incentives on the Art Channel, but I think what would be a cool concept if I got, like, a 2x2 two two mini canvas. Well, you can't see. If I got a 2x2 two two mini canvas, and then I painted mini abstract portraits every month. I think that'd be cool. And then same thing with the sketch cards, I would still mail it out to people. I mean, a caricature every month? I feel like that'd get old. That that would get old. Okay. Wait, is this even yellow? Yes. It's not. This is not. This is too dull yellow. Though. A brighter yellow. What is it? Nine sixteen. Right here. I now have obtained a yellow. Now, since I'm not going to do a color on top to fill in, I'm going to press harder. That way I get a nice solid fill. Because I want it to be a matte look. I don't want any texture when I'm shading. And I think doing, like, mini painted portraits would already match, like, the, I guess, the branding of the channel. Because the main thing we do is painting. But it's gonna be a while, so we hit affiliate on that channel, so... Chatters, hold your horses. <laughs> I'm glad everyone's excited for it, though. I talked about it yesterday, but the reason why I didn't start an art channel sooner 
is because I wanted to make sure I had an established or base audience here first that I could bring over to that channel. Because starting an art channel with zero followers or zero platform is dumb. Or not dumb, it's just not... Not a good plan of action, let's say. Let's hit affiliate immediately. I think the fastest you can get it in, is in like a week or two. So if we can hit 50 followers and average three in two weeks, that'd be crazy. I'm coming over. Why? Mods, keep an eye on Mac. Okay, I think I'm going to do the shirt yellow in the background red. So I think Titan wears the Pikachu suit, right? I'm not going to have a border, because I don't want to ruin the shirt lines over here. Oh, no to the other channel? Okay, good. I was concerned. I was like, um... Kind of sus. messed up. Wanted to keep these action lines clear. Okay, saved! Because the way that the line doesn't fully- the ear doesn't connect right to the face, it connects to that action line. So it looked funny if I overcolored it. That would be wild if I said that to you. That that be that would be kind of scary. I'd be like, "Whoa, dude!" I'd be like, "I know you're a parasocial chatter, but whoa, come your horses." Nobody has been like too weird in the chat because usually I, I I call shit out or quietly handle it, but nobody has crossed any explicit boundaries, so that's good. You're parasocial, yeah. <laughs> Block me immediately if I ever do, dude. I would. I don't give a shit. I don't care how many subs people have gifted. I don't give a fuck. If you cross any boundaries, you're done. Simple as that. Okay. Let's get a close-up of this one. This looks fucking sick. Simple line art. Simple flat color fill. But just the shape is, of the lines is really cool. Dude, that looks so good. I actually really like this one. I'm debating if I want to color in the eyes or not. 
I kind of I kind of want to touch up some of the lines actually. Hey, that's me. It is. Wait, Titans, what color are your eyes? Are they brown or blue? I can't tell. I need to know. I need to touch up some of the nose lines because I don't like how I, I didn't taper them properly. There we go, that looks a little bit better. Funky. Kinda looks like Shaggy. You know, from Scooby Doo. Okay, I think his eyes are brown. And if they're blue, then too bad. Talking about too bad, so sad. <laughs> that was stupid. <laughs> Chatters, we are four hours in the stream, so it's time for me to run a few minutes of ads. You can avoid that ad by subscribing for $4.99, just $5. Keep your coffee and get ad reviewing all month long. Or... If you link your Amazon Prime to your Twitch account, you can hashtag sub for free with Prime. Chatters, it's free. See if you got a Prime sub available. Go ahead and click that subscribe button. After the ad, we have two more cards to do. We are pushing through. Okay, so if you don't want to see ads, just subscribe. Easy. Dude, it's 3 p.m. Shit. It's getting late, guys. My finger is also getting numb, so I have to work quickly. Okay, let's finish coloring in his eyes. Also, no need to worry. It's just... Whenever I use my fingers for this long, it becomes a problem. So I just need to not overwork my hand. Dude, where's Kingly? They, they said they pay for my carpal tunny, tunny, carpal tunnel therapy. Carpal tunny. <laughs> okay, let's fill the eyes and then this one's done. Then we're going to add the little shine. I also need to touch up because I colored outside the lines a little bit. I need to go back to first grade. Okay. There you go. This one's done. You hate bacon on pizza? What is wrong with you? Bacon on pizza is amazing. Here we go. We got Titan's first card. Once again, thank you, Titans, for gifting. I think this was your sketch card from last month, because we didn't get a picture last month. But there we go. Your first card. This one looks... I really like the shape. Like, the abstract design is really cool. It overpowers it. Sag. I was going to say, it looks like Austin Powers. It looks like Scooby-Doo. Okay, next we're gonna do Titan's second card. Okay. Because they wanted a rain check on last month's card, so that's why they're getting two today. And then after this, we got one more. We're speed running.
Okay, the anatomy for this picture was weird because it's basically like a meme. So his face was stretched wide. That's why it looks weird. So Titans doesn't look like this normally. It's just the anatomy is really fucking weird on this one. That's why his face looks so wide. <laughs> I was sketching this one out this morning. I was like, I don't know how I can save this one. This one just looks so whack. Whack like Mac. Hi, Pride. Welcome in. No! Football head? Why'd you redeem? I make a sketch card. I literally was gonna disable. I'm not doing that today. I'm sorry, Pride, but I'm refunding you. Damn it, I forgot. I forgot. Okay, I'm gonna refund you, Pride. And I'm gonna disable it. Oh, screw you. I'm gonna reject it. Nice try. I, I just said my fingers are getting numb. So I, I can't. I can't do anymore. But I appreciate redeeming. You should get a refund. <laughs> Oopsie. I'll, I'll do a sketch card next time. Just not, not today. I already had enough art today. <laughs> but anyway. Opening wall today, Pride. It's okay, okay, good. As long as you got your points back, you can't complain. You know? It's like the Karens who walk into a store and they're still mad even after they got a full fucking refund. It's like, bitch, you should be glad you got a refund. these change your wallpaper I mean that's fine yeah I can change my wallpaper that's not too much of a hassle you know I get to stretch now thank you even though you can't really see them <laughs> you can't even see the wallpaper but thank you bride okay let's switch her out <sighs> stretch break Dollar Tree doesn't do refunds I hate when places don't do refunds not that I don't need a refund myself, but it's more so like the workers have to deal with a potential confrontation with like a really pissy customer, and it's not worth IMO. Because what's the point of like getting nitpicky about a um about like a twenty dollar refund? Like you're gonna lose a customer, and also like distress all your workers. It's dumb. Even exchanges only? Damn. Pretty harsh, not gonna lie. Oh no, I took the Velcro off the wall. <laughs> Oopsie. Okay, now I gotta look at it. Cause like the Velcro, it comes with an adhesive back. Because ideally you're supposed to stick it on while you sew. But it came off the wall. Uh oh. Okay. Ta da! New wallpaper. 
But thank you for redeeming pride. Get back to work. No more distractions. Yeah, it's just like, I don't get why companies just can't offer full refunds. It's like, it's not worth the hassle. Like, there's maybe like a service fee they have to pay with like their, whenever they make deposits. But it's like, it's not worth the stress. They're just nickel and diming their workers and customers. Because these brush pens are actually dual tip. They have an ultra fine liner as well. I always forget. Okay, let's get to inking. Does Titans have a bowl cut? Yeah. <laughs> I mean, nothing wrong with it. Drop my pen. Okay, so let's get a look at the line art. It's basically like the meme reaction. Like, live blank reaction. I don't know how I want to fill in the background. I might have to look at the ref picture again because I think the background is just his room.
Eli? Yeah, I guess that's his name. Wowee. It's kind of weird knowing that people have, like, names behind their users. Like, ac uh, like their actual names. That's still weird to me. Like, I don't mind if you guys call me Megan or Peace and, like, I have no preference, but... I don't like when chatters want me to refer to them by their name if it's not their user. I think it's fucking weird. Where they're like, oh, my user is... You know, I love horses, but you can call me Bob. And it's like, I'm not gonna remember your goddamn name. Okay, that wasn't very nice, but... I'm, like, I can't remember everybody's name if it's not your user, you know what I mean? Like, I can barely rem remember my own name. Yeah, it makes sense if, like, your name is part of a user, but, like, if your name isn't part of a user at all, it makes no sense. There we go. Okay, I think I'll draw, like, a simple line art of the background he sent me. Okay, I'm starting to stutter. I should go get a snack. In a second. My legal name is not Meg. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I think I'll do the line art in gray so it doesn't stand out too much. Because they have a fan and then a basically a wall. Do you like your name or do you wish your parents were with something else? I like it. It's one of those things where, like, I'm used to it. I don't care. I've never experienced any form of gender dysphoria either. So I can't... I've never experienced it. So, like, I've never had any disdain for, like, how I've looked or how I express myself or my name. And... So I, I, I just... I'm fine with it. I don't care. The only thing I don't like is that my sister's name has a similar syllable sound at the start. Because, like, you know how my name is Megan? Her name has a very similar start. So if my parents are calling for us, our, na our names sound too similar. So, like, we always, like, run up. I wish they would have made our names drastically different. But they thought it'd be cute if our names had the same letter. Because hers starts with M as well. <laughs> Megan and Meg. <laughs> no, that's not her name. You'll never guess her name. It's obscure. You know, she got the special name, and then I got normie ass Megan. Yeah, Titan's hair is a dirtyish blonde. That's good, though, that we have matching names. Oh, that she has a different name? I guess. Because my parents were like, oh my god, I don't know what we're going to name our kid. We're going to decide day of. And then they just decided on Megan after I was born. 
I, I don't think this is how it went down, but you know, when they're asking, like, when they're making the birth certificate, they're like, what is the baby's name? They're like, oh, I don't know, how about fucking Megan? Now, that's how I imagine it went down. <laughs> yeah, I think his headsets were silver. Yeah, silver and silver and black. Silver, light silver, dark gray, and then Guys, we're almost done. Only one more card after this one. They spun a while to choose a name. <laughs> they were like, uh... I don't know, Doc. I like to imagine they let the doctor decide. <laughs> That'd be funny. My mom was in labor for like nine hours when she had me though. Cause I, I just didn't want to get out of there. I wanted to stay, I guess. I think it's weird how people can schedule like a birth for like a C-section, but a C-section is so dangerous it's a very dangerous procedure because you can like bleed out and die or like have internal bleeding as well that's why like don't, just have a natural birth don't get a c-section it's not worth you were a c-section baby yes i i i think like c-section is not what you want to happen Cause like they're so d dangerous for the for the carrier for the mother. <laughs> okay, I think this one's done. And so many C-section babies in chat. Wow. I was gonna be gonna parasite, Sag. Aren't all fetuses parasites? If you look at what they do, though. Honestly. Okay, I think this card is done. Let's get a close-up. We have Titans, or I guess Elon. Meme card. Would you take my... card? <laughs> okay, once again, thank you Titans for gifting 5 plus subs during the month of September. I appreciate it. Okay. Now... We have come upon the final card of the day. Last but not least, we have Emmy Beef's portrait card. Let's get started, because my eye is twitching. I'm getting tired. Okay. So Emmy's drawing does, doesn't look anything like the actual ref. But we're going to make it work.
I'm always so jealous of Emmy's makeup. Like, her eye makeup is always on point. Because she used to do her makeup on stream. And it was fun to watch her do it. Okay, I think I did her eyes too far apart. Oh no. <laughs> Cause like her face is very like small. Her eyes are way too far apart. Uh oh. Oopsie. Too late now. Nobody tell her, nobody snitch. I think the main saving grace is gonna be the hair. On my way to snitch? No! Come on, nobody snitch. Emmy's cool. I think I'm getting tired. So my line walking, my my line work is getting wonky. We'll blame it on that. Twitter should add stories. Mm, I feel like... Don't they have, like, temporary posts? Because I know you can post to, like, your close friends or, like, a select group you're following. I know they have that. Okay, this looks literally nothing like her. I'm distressed. This looks nothing like her. This looks literally nothing like her. Snapchat is so fake. Yeah, only real ones here. It's because her- I did her features too far apart. Yeah. I mean, it, okay, actually looks fine. If I just would have made the eyes closer together, it would look a lot better. I was gonna do like her emo makeup look, but I didn't want her to look scary. If Emmy does donate to the channel this month, maybe I'll do like a, a scarier one, cause you know, Halloween.
Yeah, the Snapchat streaks are where, like, you send each other messages every day, right? I only had Snapchat for, like, a month. And then, like, I just sad posted all the time, and I was like, this is not healthy, and then I deleted the app. Okay, I'm gonna add lines to define the hair a little bit more. I think the whole concept of the Snapchat streaks is to force you to feel like you need to use the app every day. So that's why they have like millions and billions or trillions of daily users. That we can be like, oh my god, I have a two year streak with my boyfriend. We love each other so much, even though we fucking hate each other. Oh my god. Or like, ooh, look at me and my bestie. We snap each other every day. But we do it just to keep our snap running, so that way we can tell our friends how much we care about each other. I'm sure y'all can assume, but I was definitely like the negative Debbie Downer type friend. I regret being like that when I was younger, but that's just how I saw the world. Like, looking back, I wish I was more positive about everything. Okay, the hair looks a lot better now that I'm filling in the line mark. I'm actually kind of liking it now. Well, oh, that looks lovely. There should be, like, an anti-streak. It'd be cool if you could sabotage other people's streaks. You know, start like streak wars with people. You could just break their phone? Dude, somebody write that down. That's an amazing idea. Oh, the hair looks so pretty. I love drawing hair like this with the line art fill. <sighs> it's my favorite. Because it adds so much texture. Okay. Let's get a close up of the line art. And then we can start coloring. And then we can be fucking done. I love texture. Oh, that looks so pretty. Just the hair. Oh my god. Okay, I think I want to do black and pink. Because Emmy's, like, branding colors is purple or pink. I think I want to do pink today. Because I did purple last time. Okay, I know the shirt she was wearing was black. 
What's your favorite texture? I like soft food. Or like... I like the feeling of like faux silk. Because I have a few like, uh, what you call it? Like robes? Like, you know, like the faux silk robes they have? I have a few of those. I really like the feeling of it. like to touch or eat you like the feeling of wet pine needles hmm. no I okay I have a genuine fear even pre-pandemic I don't like touching soft materials at stores like you know the pillows cuz you know every motherfucker in the store touched that pillow that's on display so I refuse to touch pillows or any type of soft material unless it's closed at the store. Because, like, you know they never clean them. Because it's very hard to clean those softer materials. Yeah, it makes you think, huh? Just remind you of Butler's card? Yeah, it does. I I think Butler's card is still, my, like, my all-time favorite. Like, his card came out really nice. I'm still gonna touch it ill. Don't shake hands with Mac, guys. They touched all the pillows in the store. Okay, and so let's get back to work. Back to work. I think we're gonna do a black border. Is everybody not impressed by how straight my lines are? And I'm not even using a ruler. Have you seen the wet Hannah Montillo Hannah Montana pillow copy pasta? No, I have not, and I don't want to hear it. That sounds weird. I think I'm good. You know, let's stick with what we know. You know, this is this is personally my favorite copy pasta. That's my favorite. I, I posted a TikTok talking about that copy pasta today, actually. I think that's still my favorite copy pasta. <laughs> Do not subscribe. It's so funny. I need to stretch. Emmy has dirty blonde hair. <laughs> What's the current trend on TikTok? I don't fucking know, dude. I don't- I'm not on normie TikTok. Let's get to coloring. I think I just want to film the background pink. I don't want to do anything crazy. Because I'm tired. If we ever get to a point where I have to do like tens and tens of sketch cards every month, I'm gonna die in Minecraft. Cause even doing like five is kind of a lot. I like I said, I want to make sure we acknowledge the Oilers, but whew.
The only thing I've been seeing on my For You page is people shitting on Ned from the Try Guys. Or formerly from the Try Guys. Ayo! <laughs> That's literally like my whole for you page right now, so I don't know if there's any like big trend going on. Like, I try not to, like, get too invested in drama. Like, I will never actively seek out and read articles or posts or threads. Because I know, like, if I get into something, I'm gonna, like, fall too deep into the rabbit hole. So I just don't touch it, usually. Because, you know, I need to focus on my own shit in my own life. Not that you shouldn't care about what's going on, what's going on with other people, but, you know, you need to prioritize yourself. I read about it for like five seconds every day. Five seconds? It's gonna be more than five seconds though. Okay, I'm gonna be filling in every other like piece of hair with this kind of like duller golden red color. And then I'm gonna go in with streaks of a medium brown to kind of draw in like Seemingly individual strands of hair. Just to get a little bit of definition so it's not nearly as flat. I don't think I could ever continue a romantic relationship if my partner cheated on me. I genuinely don't think I can ever get past that. Because, like, I know I'm, like, a fully monogamous person. Monog monogamous person. Like, it's different if you are in a consensual, like, polyamorous relationship, but if you don't communicate it between all partners, then that's cheating. Like, I I've seen so many, like, bruh, like, podcasts or clips and they're like, yeah, I think I have the right to, like, cheat on my woman if she's not fucking me every night. And it's like, no. That's not, like, your partner is not an object. It's disgusting that some people think that way. Or that some people are conditioned to think that way as well. It just shows that you don't respect your partner, or you don't respect women in general. Like, no one should ever feel obligated to be intimate with their partner if they don't want to. And you shouldn't shame your partner for that. And if you feel like something is going on, you should communicate with them. It's not that hard. Don't be scared to, or don't shy away from hard conversations, if they have to be had. Once a cheater, always a cheater. Yep. Yep. Because if somebody cheats, then they're violating multiple people. Like, they're violating their current partner, and if they... If the person they are committing adultery with doesn't know that they're in a relationship, then they're violating the cheater's partner or the cheater's respect. Because, like, another thing is you don't want to spread STDs either. Like, obviously, if you're cheated on, like, it's obvious mistrust, but, like, you don't know what type of shit they could be spreading. 
Okay, final thing is lipstick and then eyes, and then we're done. <laughs> Some people are silly in not the fun way. <laughs> yeah, silly as in dumb. And I think a lot of people need to understand that if you get cheated on, it's not your fault. It's the person who did the cheating. They're the bad guy, not you. Don't ever blame yourself. I know it's hard not to, but don't blame yourself. Open communication is key? Exactly. I just need to touch up the eyebrows and then we're done. Guys, get ready to spam. I was here. I always try to make my intentions clear so I don't lead anyone on. Exactly. I have come to find as an adult, it's just better just be straightforward. Don't play fucking games with people. Like, those are their feelings that you're fucking around with, you know? Like, just be straightforward, be honest with people. Like, you know, I can flirt still, but, like, still be clear with what you want with them long-term or whatever. I'm ready. I get ready, chatters. I think this one is complete. Let's look at that. I mean, the main focus is her hair. Because, like, the ref picture I found, like, her hair was popping off. Here we go. Guys, stop your timers. We're at 4.48. Even though I think sketch cards took 3.38 because we finished at one hour uptime. I was here? Yes, you guys were here. Okay, let's look through all the cards we did today. Just get some final close-ups so that way people can take a screenshot. And also, gentle reminder, if you want a high-quality picture, DM me on Twitter saying, Hey, peace in underscore 17, I would like a high-quality picture. And I'll send it to you later. By later, I mean maybe tomorrow or Monday, because I'm tired. First, we had Nyx. First time card redeemer. Coax. Their second card. We had Mac. I think Max looks really cool. I like how the hair came out. The texture on the sweater is cool, too. Mac getting a card every single month. Colbovo. Their second card. Titans with their card from last month. I like this one. This one is super illustrated and I like it a lot. Titans second card. I guess a meme card. <laughs> it's so stupid. And then finally, Emmy Beef. Let's see, which one is my which one is Chatters? Which is your favorite? Hmm. Hmm. Mine, of course. No, I mean, like, artistically, which is your favorite? I think Nyx's is pretty solid. Like, I like how I textured the hair. Mine, of course you're gonna say your own. You guys are dumb. I think Cool Bobos, I think it's the most cohesively drawn. The render came out really well. 
I think the actual card looks nice composition wise. I think this one is my favorite of the month. I think because the drawing actually looks good. Like the actual like features match the reference picture. I didn't get a card. I think this one is cool though. This one is my second. I like how this one is really abstract. Okay, so chatters, those will be posted on Twitter later today or tomorrow because I'm tired. Um, like I said, if you want a high quality picture, DM me on Twitter and I'll send you a high quality photo. And it, you can use these for PFPs as long as you credit me. That'd be great. Um, yeah, so if you would like a sketch card yourself, all you gotta do is gift five subs by the end of October and your card will be drawn on stream on the 1st of November. All of them are my favorite. Guys, you can't do a, a kiss-ass answer like that. <laughs> I think Coax's is pretty cool, though. I do like it a lot. Um, to review, today we did our top oiler sketch cards, our top gister cop. I'm crashing. Okay, we did our top gifter sketch cards for September. And then we also did our follower journal for September as well. Let's go ahead and flip through that. There we go. We had 20 for September. But stream is not over yet, you guys, because we got a handful of gifted and bits and resubs today. So let's go ahead and break out the sub journal. It was fun as always. Thank you. And while I'm getting everything set up, if everybody who's watching right now could politely go follow my art channel. It is peace in underscore art. You can follow it by clicking that button in the chat room, or if you are on mobile, you can go ahead and click the link. And art streams will be starting on that channel probably, or no, for sure next week, either Monday or Friday. We're going to be doing a painting every week, so if you liked how today's stream went, it's going to be similar. You know, I'm going to be painting and then also talking with chat. So if everybody could go follow, it's free to follow. Go follow right now. Thank you for redeeming Cole Boba. I'll do your name first, since you're in chat. Okay, I gotta change my title as well. Holy, I'm tired. What will the first painting be? So basically the premise for the first few streams is I'm going to be painting all of my sketch cards into paintings and chat will decide. But for the first one, I want to do this one as a full painting. You know, I think this one is a good like accent piece. But then from that point on, chatters will vote from all the sketch cards we've made on stream and also my full collection of sketch cards. So that's gonna be the premise for like the first month of stream until I want to do until I start until I want to start doing like full originals. Whew. Okay, dude, I don't know how people can stream for like all day. Like they're actually insane. Okay, so first we had Kobobo redeem with their channel points. Chatters, if you want me to write your name, you can use your channel points or donate to the channel by subscribing or sharing bits. Or you can donate to me directly by typing exclamation TIP or excla ex 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 exclamation tip in chat.
<laughs> if you ever did commissions, it'd be over for my bank account. Well, I ain't doing commissions anytime soon. Cause I feel like commissions, uh, I hate working for people. Cause like, you either get two type of clients. You get people who know exactly what they want. They are very like understanding and receptive for what your suggestions are. And then you get the people who are, don't know what they want or are just literally stupid. Yeah, that's why I don't fuck with commissions. It's it's too much, like, hassle for the return, ultimately. Okay, so I'm going to do the resubs first, that way I don't miss any. Oh, we only had one resub. Okay, good. So we had Kobobo. Uh, they had purple. Oh, I gotta get my gel pens out. If I am able to move out, I cannot wait to have a separate space for art. Because, like, my room is a mess. Like, just taking everything out and then putting everything away. Such a hassle. Like, when my sister and I shared a room, um, my bedroom used to be my mom's craft room. So she would paint, she would do scrapbooking, all that type of jazz. Really? I thought people would just say what they want and then you paint it. No, it, it's so much more than that. Because, like, a good artist would be like, hey, here's some concept ideas, here's some base sketches in terms of composition. And then they're like, oh, you want to talk about color schemes? You want to talk about texture? Like, there's so many different levels if you want to be a good artist and a good service. Because, like, commission work, you're essentially doing... A service along with a skill. It also comes down to good communication between the artist and the commissioner. Because you don't want to do a commission and the customer not like it. Okay, so we had Kobobo with a three month resub. Oh, I mean, just because you would give the person creative liberty doesn't mean other customers would. Like, some people are so nitpicky. Like, I have never done commission work. I used to do art requests for free, which is actually brain dead of me to do. Um, <laughs> but just hearing art stories from artists, like going through so much trouble for like the nitpicky people, it's not worth, not worth. Okay, we had Kobobo with a three month resub, 300 bits, and one gifted for free, you say? Yeah, that was back when I was in high school. Would you ever make a shop if you got a P.O. box? Uh, what would I sell though? Because I told myself I don't want to sell prints. I think stickers or keychains would be fun. But then you, it, there's so many like, levels to selling like physical products that people don't understand 
Like, you can easily outsource, like, your printmaking or your keychain making to, like, third-party vendors. But it still takes a while to, like, figure out which vendor is good, if their product is as good as they say it is. There's a lot. And, like, I told myself, if I ever release a physical product, I want it to be the best it can be. But in terms of, like, paintings, I would just ship them myself. But I would still have, a, have to have a P.O. box if I ever start shipping shit. So. It's just a lot to think about. <laughs> Redeem's artist sketch card. Somebody already tried to do that. And I said, no, I refunded points because I am tired. I definitely think out of all the stream types, art streams are the most exhausting because it's a lot on my hands. It also requires like a lot more concentration than a gaming stream does. A drawn up clothing design would be cool. Hmm. You know what I would love to do? I would love to be on a design team that did pattern work for clothing. Like, I would love to design, like, not the actual, like, cutting patterns, but, like, designing prints to be, like, dyed onto patterns. I think that'd be really fun. Oh, I would love to design tote bags. Like, you know the tote bags that are canvas and then they get, like, screen printed in illustration? I think that'd be fun. I would love to have a screen print shop. Because getting a screen printer and also getting, like, the, the stencils and the actual material to do screen printing is expensive. But I would love to design clothing and, like, make it myself to sell. Like, I wouldn't make everything. I would, I would obviously, like, hire employees but i think that'd be a really fun endeavor i just realized it's not on camera i'm sorry guys fire me uh we had mac gift a tier one to the chat thank you mac we changed this angle there we go that's better remember when i jostled my camera earlier there we go yeah i agree screen printing is so cool Cause like I've made stencils on my own and if I have my Cricut, I could do vinyls too. Cause vinyl t-shirts are a lot easier to make than screen printing, but they don't last as long than a screen print would. Hey, once again, thank you Kobobo for the bits and gifted and that resub and then also Mac for a gifted to the chat. Maybe you got two more names left guys. Oh, I, I need to pre-draw my guidelines. I keep forgetting. There we go. Make sure it's on screen this time. Okay, final two names. If you want me to write your name, I gotta do is donate to the channel or use your channel points.
Oh, I thought I had a blister on my pinky, but I don't. I got scared. Okay, we had Titans with 900 bits. Once again, thank you. What is vinyl printing? So, vinyl isn't printing because the way the screen printing works is you have a stencil that's made out of like cloth and then you put paint and then you scrape the paint on top and then you press it onto the fabric. But vinyl is, it's a plastic material that you iron onto fabric. Like, you know, like the, I think this shirt is vinyl. Cause like, if you feel it, it feels kind of plasticky or it feels kind of like dried paint, but it's plasticky, that's a vinyl. But a screen printing is where like the ink actually seeps into the fabric. You choose the color? Okay. I'll write your name right after this one, okay, Lemon? Yeah, for sure, Cooks. I would, like I said, I have done like some research on my own about like screen printing and vinyl. And like, I would love to get into it, but it's a very expensive endeavor. And like, not really worth unless you can have guaranteed people buy your shit. So, I think vinyl would be the easiest to get into because like, I already have a cricket. And my mom told me if I do move out, then she would give me the cricket. So, $300 value. Because the Cricut could actually do some pretty intricate and detailed cuts, surprisingly. Like, you know, all the stencils that I've used for the wallpaper, it's all been cut with the Cricut. I don't know if y'all could tell, but on my Peason underscore art Twitter account, the promo graphic where it said Peason underscore art on live on Twitch, the lettering, that was cutout paper that was made with the Cricut. Seamless cutout that it made. Okay, so we had Kingly with five gifts into the chat room. They sped their way to the top of the leaderboard. Thank you, Kingly. First time gifter. Hey, yo. Okay. And last name. We had Lemon. And they said any color. Sounds good, hun. My family should I said I should get a Cricut. What do you want to do with it? Because, like, the only thing that I use the Cricut for is for paper cuts. And I don't do it often. Because, like, the software is pretty easy to navigate. You just have to determine if it's a reasonable enough investment. Because it's expensive. And also the material is expensive, too. Like, you shouldn't get it just to get it. Like, you have to have, like, projects in mind that you want to do. Vanilla, or Lemon's name is so fun to write. Got Ice, Lemon, Vanilla. <laughs> Wingly. <laughs> okay, chatters, last call. If you want me to write your name, I gotta do is donate or use your channel points. Yeah, I want to get one of those, like, automated embroidery machines. Those look so cool. There you go, Lemon. People pog. Wow. Okay, last call. Last call. Dude, I'm so tired. Whew. Okay, we're done. I'm gonna adjust the camera, so. Perfecto. Okay. 
Yeah, embroidery machine also expensive. <laughs> okay. Chatters, we're done. I'm done. I am tired. <laughs> but thank you to anybody who... I need... To... Sorry, the camera's over here. I need to look at the camera. No, but thank you to anybody who watched too many chatter slickers. I appreciate everybody who hung out today. I was gonna say something else. Oh, um, I will be live again tomorrow. Probably at 11 a.m. PST with Cult of the Lamb. It is an interactive viewing experience, meaning if you're gonna watch tomorrow's stream, watch on desktop. Because if you're watching on desktop, you can actually join my cult in game, not in real life. So, if you're going to watch tomorrow, make sure it's on desktop and you get to enjoy the fun extensions. Um, and then Monday, we're probably launching the art channel. So, once again, if everybody watching right now could go follow Peason underscore art. If you're on desktop, you can click the follow button right here. Or if you are on, if you are on mobile, you can click the link I just posted in the chat room. Meg Colt leader confirmed. Yeah, it's going to be scary. I was gonna buy like some edgy jewelry, but I don't have time today because stream went longer than I thought. Wait, I didn't run an ad at five hours. Uh oh, Twitch is gonna get really mad. <laughs> um, so like I said, I'll be live again tomorrow with Colts of Lamb at probably eleven. And go follow the art channel. Wowie, please go follow. I'd love it if that channel does well. Um last thing is if everybody could go follow me offline social media i'd be twitter instagram and a tiktok if you could follow all three that'd be amazing but thank you to anybody who chatted who watched who lurked who hung out for the whole stream or came in just for a little bit i appreciate everyone um sketch cards will be posted on twitter probably later because i gotta go take a nap uh, once again, thank you to everybody who donated today. We had Cold Bobo, Kingly, Mac, and Titans. Thank you everybody for gifting or cheering or resubscribing. I appreciate it. Like I said, I'll be live again tomorrow in the morning. I will see you all then. Okay. Bye.